welcome retired filmmaker George Lucas. It really, is the fact that we have to switch streams, it is a, it is sort of a, a way of telling us that this isn't the way the system was designed to be used. <laughs> <laughs> Doing a show this long is a fundamental misuse of the technology. Uh-huh. Uh, what of are we course. money-wise as far as me showing a little bit of Star Wars? Uh, we are at... Oh, shoot, hang on one sec. Let me log in. George, let's bring in some guests really quick, though. Yeah, absolutely. Because I think this is important. I have two guests, and I don't know if the other each guest know the other one is here, but we're about to find out. We're going to find out. This um, is one way to find out. This is great. All right, here we go. I want them to know they're not on the show yet because we want right. to know how they want to be introduced. That's what right. we need to get from them. Right. All right, guys. Here All right. Gabriel hey. Shear. Shear hey. and Gabriel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, how hey. do you guys want to be introduced? Because you're not you're, on the show. You're, I mean, you're, you're live. live. Everyone can see and hear you. It is being broadcast, but this isn't the show. This is just the part where we sure. find out how you want to be introduced. Yeah. And well, then I mean, Watto, Watto, when he comes back, he will introduce you. Also, yeah, of course. Ha Happy Mando Monday. Happy Mando Monday. Happy Mando Monday. I know where, uh, um, yeah. Is it Mando you know, Monday already? It's, well, well, not for you guys. We, for not, 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 not technically for me, but I start celebrating because uh, the show is based in New York. I start celebrating when it turns. Oh, shit. Because I didn't put any Vescar yeah, on my the door yet. The Mandalorian that's yeah. set in New York? <laughs> no. No. The, no. Oh. New York uh, it is not New York City at the time that the Mandalorian takes place. You but know these. The first thing we say in any Star Wars thing is that these take place a long time ago, Paul. Well, I mean, technically, the Mandalorian does not have that scroll. Yeah, I know, but it's deeply implied by. God, their, I, I always it's, thought it's I, loaded. I, it is loaded with context clues. Until Paul. until I saw Ahsoka Tano, Paul, I thought that this George, was, yeah. John, yeah. you guys are not on the show yet. How do you guys want to be introduced? Yet. Well, of course. I mean, I just I'm here. I'll be introduced, be however, late. just first oh, yeah. or second, either one. But whichever. What do you guys consider the level? Like, what's the status way? Like, how would you describe that? I think Gabrus has got to go first because yeah. the audience wants to see Gabrus, and then yeah. I'm going to come in here as an observer. Yeah, and I'll be observer. from the radio, uh, from the Radio Land News Network, which is my uh, George Lucas fan site, and I'm going to obviously get some gossip, some hot gossip, and I want to make sure that we get the word out to our subscribers. Uh, yeah. you know, about this event. So, Paul, do you want the do you want the and or do you want the with? Um, we, uh, you know, let me think. Like, no, I just think from radio, yeah, just from, yeah, from, from radio yeah, land from. news network. And I can okay. tell you the whole well, then I, I definitely want to go first, or at least I want to hear, I'll go second, but if it goes and not from radio land yeah. news network, okay, John we goes. can do it that way. We can do it that way, sure. George, do you want to do it or do you want me to do it? I never want to do it, you know, okay. I don't. guys. We have Water two guests on doing, doing, doing this anyway when he gets back. Here he is, he's here, Wado. Yes. You need to introduce our guests like this. From La Radio Land's News Network, Paul Shear, and not from Radio Land's News Network, John Gabris. Okay. You going to do it? Oh, now? Yeah. Yeah, right yeah. Now. You didn't tell me when to do it. Do it now. <laughs> Okay, well, from Radio Land News Network, Paul Shear, and not from Radio Land News Network, John Gabriel. Hey, hey, how are you? Wow. Wow, wow. For the delay, Patrick never told me when to do the introduction. I was waiting. I got to say, Watto, I think that Patrick actually set the introduction wrong, and you self-corrected it because you're such a pro. What did I like, say? You you said it no you way. Said that Paul, you said Paul. I heard right. Paul Gabris and John Shear. I heard yeah. Paul Gabris and weird. John Shear. Was like, it was something weird. Sound good. I wrote it in the yeah. chat. Like, You've already messed up the intros, but then Watto just pulled yeah. it together. Like a you pro. added, you added all this weird editorializing in it too. Like you were like these fuckers, this this fucking asshole with his big swinging dick over here, Paul Shear, and I was like. These guys are friends of this show. I'm not going to say the show. Back. There was a lot of editorializing, Patrick. <laughs> okay. Okay. I was surprised by it. Wait, what? Can, uh, can the audience see this part? Yes. Yeah. They can see okay, all cool. of it. Okay, cool. And, it and I, can, I can see this as well. Yeah. yeah. Everyone. Yeah. yeah. Got yeah. it. Just Got it. The world. Cool. Yeah. Jesus Christ, Patrick. That's a hell of a... That's a hell oh, of an like, angle change. That's a hell of an angle wow. change over there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that was funny. He did this to help feed people.
That was when we had twenty four thousand dollars. That was what came up. It does now, feel to me like that's a character that Mando might bump into in a in a local yeah. cantina. Uh huh. Yeah. I'm yeah. fine with that. Now, I George, all, those are some yeah. those are some of my favorite of your characters. Like you'll have like these wildly creative Mon Calamari, Rodian, but then sometimes you'll have a guy that's just a bug or another guy that just has a weird haircut. And they're yeah, not humans because Earth doesn't exist, but they just have right. like a strange haircut. Yeah. It's yeah. a rat with weird hair. Yes. Hey, can can we see the uh this the spreadsheet of the donations? Yes. I want to see where we're just, at right now. I just sent yeah. Dave a new one and hopefully they'll be able to bring it up in one second. I'm telling them up. Uh, right that's now, not, Paul, we, that, that's not been, a date. It's actually 26271 is where we are at right now. 26271. Yeah. I have a stretch goal for 26500. Okay. What is it, Wado? Wado makes a new body. Okay. Wow. All right. Holy shit. Wow. All right. Wando and does the person makes, have to pay twenty six thousand five hundred dollars, or just help you get to that level? We just got to get to that level. That's Correct. Well. But that's a separate question. Uh, okay. If we get to uh, fifty two thousand dollars, is that now, right? Yeah. Yeah, just about. I would say you can go fifty two uh, five forty to be oh, safe. 50, how are you guys, fifty two five. Really this is really uh, an elaborate, <laughs> an elaborate Excel document. Uh, oh, I really yeah. want to oh, get sorry. in here. Oh, oh, we can't all raise thirty thousand an hour like some yeah. people. You know? this is the, we've been we've been at this since since ten a.m. Eastern time, seven a.m. Pacific time. I realize for you, you look at that Jesus number. Jesus Christ! Like, <laughs> yeah, you, you look at you look. I at forgot that about the time think, zones. <laughs> yeah, well, but here here's what I'll say. I feel like I've I've been on here twice where. You are in these this this moment, this moment where I believe that you know you guys are you're tired, George, and you know, and it, it's sort of like when you were kind of doing the final edit on Phantom Menace, that kind of that just driving to get it to the theaters, and we're gonna yeah. get you over the top. We're gonna get this stretch goal going. How much wow. do you need to make for the stretch goal? Uh, we need uh like two hundred and fifty bucks. We'll say. Watto yeah. makes a new bud. And, now, have and we does the stretch goal where I show a little bit of Star Wars? I have to look. Hang on. And also, uh, Mando Mondays. I'm supposed to spoil uh, Mandalorian. Uh, now that it's Mando Monday, we've been warning people since 10 a.m. that we would be spoiling uh, season <laughs> two finale of I Mandalorian. Will, I will say this. I yeah. just started it. So, I mean, I, I anyone who had Twitter, I saw a certain name trending. And I okay, don't say it. it. Don't say it. Don't say it. I'm don't say, say it. it. I saw Ezra Bridger trending, and I clicked on it, and I was like, yeah. what? Ezra Bridger is in this episode of Mandalorian. I was so upset. Yeah. One of your famous creations, right, Ezra Bridger? <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. Now, wait a second. Let's take Paul off the stream for one sec. Let's take him yeah, off for sure. a second. Okay, no, Watch, he'll probably go make $30,000 while he's off the stream. <laughs> yeah, he'll go make he'll come back and raise more money for charity while he's off the stream than we did this whole fucking Some day. other charity. He jumped over to Ron Funch's Twitch and made the quick 30K. Yeah, he's over in Funchtown. Wait. So now Sheer, now the audience can see Sheer, and we're backstage now. No, no we're in front. Exactly. He's backstage. Got it. Okay, okay cool. Yeah. And I can see us. I can see us. Yeah. Also. All right. Yeah. Got here's it. Cool. The, here's the interesting position we're in. Paul thinks that he spoiled this episode for, of Mandalorian for himself by unfortunately stumbling upon a spoiler. However, he is incorrect. <laughs> Ezra Bridger does not appear in the most recent episode. Should we continue <laughs> to provide fake spoilers for Paul so that he thinks the episode is ruined, but in fact, it is preserved? I think that's a good idea. I think that's Bring a good idea. Bring Paul back on. All right, here we go. Wait, wait, and was did you need oh, my oh, feedback? Oh, oh, no, 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 did no, you no. need me? Did you need I input on that at all? Was I supposed to be there? Am I doing a layup or something? Do I need to help out in any way here? Yes, yes no, we're and, good? baby. Yes, and. Got it. Let's go. Let's rock and roll. Also, Patrick, also, Patrick, eventually when Paul's not on the stream, and it's fine if he hears this part, mm -hmm. uh, eventually when, when Paul is not on the stream, uh, even though we already are in the thick of Mando Monday, 
yeah. I still am going to need the bumper to count down to Mando Monday and sing sure. a little song, which is going to spoil uh, season two of the Mandalorian finale. Okay, George, really quick, can I just bring someone uh, to? Can I bring someone in really quick? Yeah, absolutely. All right, and now uh, they already gave me their introduction, and now here to give a clean reading of the word McClunky, Jason Manzukas. McClunky. Thank you, Jason. It was so good seeing you. Wow. That was great. Holy shit. That, that was, was worth the price of admission there. Mm -hmm. Great. Right. How did Paul, that get made? Mm -hmm. Paul, I'm glad that cheered you up because I really feel for you. What an unfortunate position you're in having accidentally found out that Ezra Bridger is all over the newest episode of Mandalorian. I mean, and what was upsetting to me is, like, I guess, like the internet is saying it's Rob Lowe that's playing Ezra Bridger, and I, I didn't feel Lowe. that seems so old. I mean, I, I like Rob Lowe. All, yeah, I like him. That but set the like Doughboys that. Reddit on fire finding out yeah. Rob Lowe was in Mandalorian. They're furious about this. Yeah. It's so weird. Everyone's angry at the Doughboys all over again. Not oh, yeah, angry yeah. at Kathleen Kennedy at all. It's like, no, no, it's people, people, I mean, if you listen to the biography, only ones who get criticized for associating with Doughboys, with Rob Lowe. In I mean, I'll say this. I'll say this. Where does Mando hang out a lot? Where is uh, he in, going back to? And in, we're in like, his ship. Yeah, but what in, what planet does he keep going back it, to from the original the original movie? The Doughboy subreddit. He keeps going to Tatooine. I'd say Mando's something of a heat seeker. So it oh makes sense. shit! Yeah, oh, he would yeah, want right. to go where there's two uh, sons. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man, Mitchy, two okay. sons. Well, Paul, it is true. I mean, it's been a ruin for you. Rob Lowe does play as a bridge runner, and not only is he too old for the role. But you must know at this point that he weirdly, as an ego flex, was like, oh, I think I'm a little young for the role. So rather than yeah, I didn't watch any, I didn't watch any of the interviews, but I saw like uh, a screen grab of his Instagram uh, reacting to it. And that really. Yeah, I just didn't like it. And I know that like they did his head weird. Uh, they, like they I, aged I don't know. him up. They did a digital aging like the yeah. end of the end game. Looks weird. It looked weird to me. And, you know, whatever. I mean, look, I'm a huge fan of Rebels, uh, and I wanted to see that character. So when Ahsoka Tano said, like, you know, you're going to meet that powerful Jedi, I, I thought it was going to be, you know, somebody different, you know. But, and uh, yeah. You know about the after credits scene, right? Yeah, did you no. stop after the credits? No, I didn't know what was the after credits. You didn't hear oh, what happened to Lobot? Oh, Wait, is it Mando Lobot? Monday yet? Officially? Oh, Mando Monday. Lobot's yeah, it's Mando Monday. Oh no, I spoiled that Lobot is in the end credits. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. I thought you were gonna do the big one. That's the first and, brave uh, one that please tell me I who's I'm playing sorry. Lobot? Who do you oh. think? Who do you think? This is bumming. This is oh, this is really gonna Is this is this I, how you found out you didn't get it? <laughs> no, I, I, I had heard that they were kind of doing a whole different thing with it. It's yeah. Jenny Slate, right? It's Jenny Slate is Lobot. Yeah. yeah, I mean, which is fine. I love Jenny. I think she's super funny. It doesn't feel like okay. it doesn't even really feel reminiscent of Lobot. I just feel like you're doing yeah. a whole different thing. At least like that's, when you that's see good. Tamora yeah. Morrison and he's as Boba Fett. Like you believe that okay, that you know, even though it wasn't him right. under the the armor in the in the first in George and your you know trilogy, uh, but he yeah. does have the gravitas of that. Yeah, she's right, not so the that's... obvious child for the role, so I like it. It's no. like it hits different, you know. It's just a cool I choice. Mean, I like yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And and Paul, I commend you that you have a healthy attitude, that you have a good perspective on this, and you're not jealous of what Lobot gets to do in the after credits, which I assume you've heard of. Them. No, I did not. Wait, what? Oh, what did no. he do? Oh no, no, no Are no, you no. got to be kidding me? Oh boy, I, Paul, I don't want to spoil this for you. I mean, All I right. feel like. What's a tease? Are, are, do you know what the sexual position the pile driver is? I've heard of it. Sure, absolutely. I mean, I, I like to look at stuff on the internet. That's the only clue I'm going to give you. That's the only oh, no, clue. This I'm is our, all right, so this is it. Then it's the whole the whole Lando thing. Like Lando's by just like uh, like Star-Lord is by. Oh, that's the whole Lando. Yeah, I mean, I, I, and this is kind of the whole Marvel shared Star Wars universe. You know it. Yeah. Right, so you know it. Lobot power drivers Lando, and that means you must know what Sai Sudo does. I mean, it seems like you know everything. Well, I don't know. I don't, I don't want to hear about Sai Sudo's. I, uh, 
but I'm I'm, rare, that I'm sorry. Rare Bird Reba is asking, are these actual spoilers? She's she's still muted, so we have to wrap up the spoilers so that Rare Bird okay. Reba could unmute and enjoy the stream without being feared okay. about Ma Mando Monday. Way, yeah. Uh, Dice Noodles, of course, uh, eats Droopy McCool's ass. And oh because no. Dice Noodles has the extended, long, skinny mouth, she's like all the way on the other side of the room. Yeah. She's like all over her. At least L337 isn't in it, right? No. No. No L337. Oh, good. That's good. No. Okay. You That's walk out there. Yeah. All right. Everybody tell Reba, Rare Bird Rita, that she can come yeah. back for now. Rare Bird Reba. Rare Bird, Rare Bird Reba. Reba. You can unmute it now. All good. All good. Oh, Mando, Mando Monday is over. Oh, no. no Mando spoilers, okay? Guys, I put a potential uh, 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 stretch goal in the chat. Can you guys just look really quick and tell me what you think? Um, <laughs> um, you let me know what you guys think. I, I give it an enthusiastic yes. Where are we right now? We are at twenty six <laughs> seven one. Okay, and and wait, wait a second. Twenty six two seven one. And and where was the what was the stretch goal for Watto makes a new bud? Twenty six five hundred. Okay. I like where we stand. Okay. Should we should we say that's that really Watto? I really like that you really. I feel like you use that kind of you know, uh, con man idea. You really, you really sat with that. I really like that. I'm really trying to, to long game this one, but I think, yes, we should make the announcement. Okay. I'm going, I'm going to have the hat, the, the sequel hat here on standby <laughs> because we are adding a stretch goal to potentially okay. do an episode two. Is that fair to say? Yes. I mean, yeah. yeah. And, and, I mean, and, and Watto, I mean, has it been announced yet in the, I, I know they had the big uh, investor meeting. Yeah. Uh, and I know that like, you know, Don Cheadle is doing the Iron War, you know, the, like the Marvel, yeah. they're spinning off all the characters. Is there any like kind of like, you know, Watto kind of Sanford and Son style comedy oh, uh, oh, show oh, happening on Tatooine? Oh boy. Oh. Well, they Disney has, Disney Star Wars has not announced it, but we at the George Lucas talk show uh, beginning last week, uh, have started announcing 10 new Star Wars uh, spinoff shows every episode, uh, wow. and we will do so every week for the next 10 years. Wow. Uh, the question so, isn't, is there a Watto spinoff in the works? It's how many Watto spinoffs. I yeah, love yeah. I mean, that. Young Watto, old Watto, middle-aged Watto. You know, I, George, I want, I I want a full just... streaming service of people who use faces you've never seen. I just want a full <laughs> streaming service of all helmet-wearing characters. Give me yeah. 20 shows, have just all voiceover done completely by stand-ins. Who gives a <laughs> shit? I'm so pumped for that, George. I think that's a yeah. fucking fun we, idea. We just, greenlit, we just greenlit earlier this evening Mandalorians of a certain age. We are bringing back Ray Romano, Andre oh, yes! Power, not Bacula. Yes. Just and their voices. It's, it's perfect. It's are easy big for them. Are, are they can do it on their cell phone <laughs> to say things like, no, it doesn't matter to me or whatever. And then, and then you just get the stand-ins, and it's a great gig for the stand-ins. They love to walk around and... It's you can shoot a poker stuff. episode in the volume, like they for like they shoot Mando. You can shoot that. You can shoot a fucking season of a Mando's playing poker. You can shoot that in a fucking. Yeah. You need fucking yeah. eight minutes of footage. You could just rerun it with whatever voiceover you want. Yeah, fucking Absolutely. smart. smart All right, stuff, so guys. here here are some stretch goals I want to add. So twenty six five hundred. Watto makes a new bud. Uh, Jersey Dave, don't bring this up yet. Twenty six seven fifty. A message from a friend. Twenty seven thousand. George is going to show a clip from Star Wars. Okay. And 27,500, I'm going to say what the episode we do it. You're going to say what it is a second episode of? I think so. I think we have to in order to hit it. Yeah. I Here we go. Your judgment. Second episode of Talking Tea. The helmet is here. It's ready for when. And you guys should know what that I means. If you want a second episode, 27,500. If we don't hit it. Wow, talking tea. I mean, that is worth it right there. Talking yeah. tea. Guys, oh, yeah. this is a big time show. You don't have many emotes. Where are your emotes for this show? Uh, I mean, let's call them in here. Hey, Bryson, can you come in here, Bryson? Does that What's an emote like this? 
I mean, there, does there, anyone know what time it is in Switzerland? Work? I can't get my banker on the line. I can't get my banker on the line to try to hit these stretch goals. Does anyone know what time it is in Switzerland? Is, I mean, do you have any... I mean, my watch is always. Yeah, these oh, are hang on. I'm being told in the private chat to clarify what talking tea is. <laughs> don't worry about it. Two, I don't care. <laughs> episode two of Talking Tea with Zooks and the Boys. That's episode two. Oh, <laughs> we have Zooks and the Boys for this one? Yes, yes. You know, tea drinking and, and, and Zooks has been under a lot of scrutiny on the how did this get made. Uh, yeah. Show. Yeah, we, <laughs> we this show laid down a marker that we are on we are on team t yeah you know um look my wife was taking a very strong stance against it and i would dare not re you know reveal to her that i have some reboots uh t is that how you pronounce it reboots uh, in, in the cupboard rubos marco rubios rubos? marco rubios t uh, i drink you... it and then i make some crazy statements about covid are you <laughs> saying there is potential for you to put Look, I mean, look, I've got on the kettle and make some rubble. I have I, one of the things I asked for when uh, when we moved mm -hmm. uh, was to get a sink that had a hot water uh, dispenser in it so I can make tea like that. Just got to hit a button. Don't even have to get the hot water ready to go. It's boiling on a minute's a second's notice. Wow, dude, that's baller. That's some real life you fucking. You demanded hot shit. water on standby for you constantly. I once saw somebody have like this hot water dispenser. And I was like, this is a great thing. It can't be that expensive. I was right. It was not very expensive at all. It's just like a small little spout that just shoots out hot water. Yeah. Wow. It's weird. Like the small things in life that, you know, that would truly improve your life in some way aren't yeah. as expensive as you imagine. Oh yeah, I make I make a pot of pasta. That, that hot water's in there. It's just it, everything's getting a little bit easier. A little bit. You want to rinse dog shit off your shoes? You just run them over to the hot water right. cooler, blast yeah, some yeah. hot there water. There should be there should be uh, in season three of Mandalorian. You know how he has that thing that shoots fire. He should have one that shoots hot water. It's really simple button. And just sometimes every now and then you want to when the fire doesn't work, you just blast with the hot water. Or you don't want to waste your fire on something that you know that scalding water will do the trick. Yeah, scalding water is going to really just knock out a lot of the enemies. I mean, uh, a lot of people are wearing a lot of armor in this thing. So, yeah. you know, yeah. that's going to work all the, the time. people but... who don't have armor, it's even just the shock of it. They won't be expecting it. You get a, a hot and wet all of a sudden, you, oh, you're not going to mess with them. Is this yeah. Star Wars hack angle? Like, what is trooper armor protect them from? I feel like blaster shots still just, oh, like, if they're like, uh, should I wear the armor? It's like, you're going to get shot with a blaster and die anyway. It's up to you. We just kind of wear it so no one knows we're all clones or something. Because like, I don't. They seem. To, it seems like if you're gonna fucking just get toast right the second you get off one of the ATSTs, it's like just fucking leave the armor off. Let's run free, yeah, dude. To me, I'm. Yeah. To me, I'm like this. The the Empire spent so much time building mm -hmm. all these giant ships, doing all this sort of stuff. Uh, just invest in Beskar. Just get a lot of that <laughs> armor because it seems like once you have Beskar armor on, you ain't gonna get hit by nothing. Yeah. It's gonna be fine. Just say, Shit, I didn't put out my producing best car. We should be doing that. That's that should be the empire's primary focus right there. It's just that you just reminded. Well, did you put your best car out uh, over your door for uh, Mando Monday? You're supposed to put, <laughs> put it out best, on Sunday I, night I, before. I, well, I put a best car on the door just like a mezuzah, you know, so people just uh, <laughs> they, they touch it before they come in. They know they're yeah. in a safe house. Oh, this is the way. See, I'm a I'm a goy, I'm a goy. So I did not. We just have it. I was referring to it like the uh, Notre Dame uh, thing that Rudy and all the guys tap Look, before. Yeah, I'm a goy too, but I understand Jewish culture because I'm. You know, I like to make sure that I understand everything. Well, I can. I I know why we understand Jewish culture because we're. Uh, Paul doesn't like to talk about this, but we're both from a, a a galaxy far, far away and a long, long time ago. It's called Long Island, George. I think you. This place would surprise you. It's like a fucking the most Eisley cantina a yeah, of Richard, I have a villainy. yeah i get it <laughs> i i've seen the the mask protests outside of bars on the news i get it yeah we're like the art we're like a less classy version of orange county yeah <laughs> going on in orange county and uh, los angeles we're we're like that less yeah we're we're much more into billy joel and yeah. uh, and roast beef sandwiches and Fuck not yeah <laughs> yeah the gym, um, gym being equally important there, but gym is a big part of the culture. It feels like big part. <laughs> I'm, I'm looking at, I'm looking at these PayPal totals, and it's almost like people don't want episode two of Talking Tea. People, Patrick, start, wow. Every time you lean in, I feel like I'm watching the Prodigy Firestarter music video. <laughs> like, <laughs> I 
don't know what that means. That's well, the most. Yeah, that might be a weird idea. reference. That must be just for thirty-eight-year-old kids who, when they were in junior high, didn't want to listen to ska with their friends. Oh sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get some. Let's get does some. This some help numbers numbers here. I feel like, does this help a little bit more numbers How much money do we need to get? I don't know. <laughs> we heard you were a thirty thousand dollar an hour man. I, well, that's why I need to get. Oh, are we have we officially started the show? I know that we've been probably yeah. been here for about like a handful. Of, we've been here for about twenty five minutes, but I didn't know if the show had actually started yet. Yeah, yeah. Paul, I mean, whatever you do, Paul, whatever you do, whatever it is that you do, <laughs> do it now. Like All right. well, we don't know what you did to get thirty thousand dollars in one hour. What the goal is? You got to tell me what the goal is. So right now we are at Eating America. Yeah, that's the goal. America. We're at 26719. 26. Okay. It's going. It's climbing. We need to get to 27.5 to get to episode two of Talking Tea. Okay. Hold on. Let me write this down because I got to get into my numbers here. Okay. 26719. Uh, How much to get to that? 27.5. We'll get that. We're going to get that by the end of the hour. Yeah, All right, people. Yeah. Here's the deal a dollar makes a difference. Right now, if full everyone, screen, full screen, Paul. If there's 536 people watching right now. Mm -hmm. If you all give a dollar, yeah. and the person in this group who's got a lot of money gives three, we are well on our way. Let's see. Everyone give a dollar right now. One dollar. That's $536. I bet you when you start to put in that dollar, you're like, that's a waste. Let me give five. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to get talking tea. We're going to get a new Star Wars episode. Yeah. I'm going to finally ask George the questions that all the people at Radio Land News Network has been wanting to know the answer to. We're going to talk a little bit about Francis Ford Coppola and what he's been doing with uh, Godfather 3, the redo. Yeah. Uh, and we're going to get into it all. But all we need is everybody right now, one dollar. One dollar. Yeah. Can you do it? Can you do it? I'm going to do it right now. I'm going to do it myself. Can I, I, I'm I give got that a scam $1. idea. Can I go full screen? And uh, tell me to stop if this is something that would get you like booted off Twitch. I got a very yeah, sure. fucking... <laughs> I got a, everyone who's watching this five, like Paul was saying, if you don't have the dollar text 20 of your weirdest friends and be like, I'm watching this weird ass stream right now. And if everyone can send me a dollar, I can get Zooks T or whatever the fuck the main goal is. But abuse your non weirdo friends, your friends who are like, it's a Sunday night. I can't do a live stream. It's what it's 12, it's 12 plus hours. And who is it? And but what movie has he yeah. done? Don't worry about all that. Just ask them to Venmo money. You say, pal, next thing you know, you're fucking talking tea with Zooks. And I'm promoting you to Society of Protectors, in which you learn another valued skill set, which will help you continue to earn for both yourself and for feeding America. Okay? That's what Pop I want for on. you. Pop me back on. Pop Give, me it back on. Give it to Paul. Give it back to Paul. All right, here's the deal, people. You got me, you got Gabrus, you got Zooks on decks. What do you want? We can do things verbally here. Like, let's throw some money down on it. What it what does it cost to you for us to maybe say something or do something that is not offensive, but maybe, you know, whatever you want. But we'll see. We can look at the You're price. Paying, these people are paying two hundred dollars to have Van Dam mumble a fucking random happy birthday message while drinking a diet coke on cameo we're gonna give you about quality quality cameos quality cameos or whatever uh the other day someone if you donate ten dollars oh, right now if you donate ten dollars right now i'll and a premise i'll do a cameo here that's directed by paul Shear. Oh, i will good. do a, a, a so a oh, cameo God, by four, john gabriel and yes Fuck it, yeah, for $20, we'll, we'll each do a personal cameo directed okay. by the other one. Okay, so twenty. let's do $20 because that will uh, – $10 is going to add up very quickly. Let's do $20 yeah. uh, you can, <laughs> do a cameo. And I got I got a message. And, and, and if anyone cool. wants to give $50, I yeah, will show you cool. the Star Wars ornament that everyone in my house hates, but I refuse to uh, take off the tree. Yeah, and wow. uh, put me full screen. I got a message. Okay, hang on one sec. Give them full screen to George. Full Give screen. it to George, baby. Yeah, right. So I, I'm, I'm, I'm a rich guy, and I know we we want everybody to chip in every little bit they can. And Paul delivered that message uh, very effectively just now. But this is a message for the person watching this who knows they're the richest guy watching. Some guy out there, and you know, one dollar means nothing to you. Mm -hmm. You know, you're the richest guy watching the stream. You're hanging around. You're making comments, yeah. and you know. 
I'm a rich guy. Well, I got a message for you, rich guy. Why don't you prove it? <laughs> yeah, prove it. <laughs> Show how little your money means to you by throwing a ton of it at the at feeding America. And you'll know, you know, there'll be people behind the scenes. Patrick, Jersey Dave, Bryson, they'll be seeing these numbers come in. They'll be like, whoa, this guy. And they'll look at your user, username, which would be some like squirrel face or whatever. There'll be something coming up. <laughs> yeah. Be and, and William and, Gates. <laughs> yeah. 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 Bouncy, bouncy, bunny rabbit. Whatever your name is going through here, you know that you're going to have Patrick Connor, Jersey Dave, Bryson. They're all going to be looking at him like, this is the richest guy watching Planet Scum right now. He doesn't care about anything. He doesn't give a fuck. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a good vibe. Show I us, think George show is us right. how rich you are. Show us how rich you are by feeding a lot of people who need food right now because you already ate today. I also, George, I also want to say that this. I know we're not Make him full screen. screen. Make him full screen. Oh, Make him full screen. We're not allowed to take pictures at Skywalker Ranch. I was there. I worked on my documentary there, but I do have an official Skywalker Ranch ornament on my tree. I'll show that to you. I'll show it to you. Have you ever seen an official? I mean, I know you have George and I know you have Watto, but yeah. has anyone yeah. seen what they release to the, to the public? I'm going to say 27,750. Paul shows us that ornament. Hey, it's there. The ornament's there. And somebody, I said, for 10 bucks, I'll kiss Anakin. I just Whoa. have to figure out my blocking. Yeah. Okay. And the thing is, when we get to, I know some people are thinking, oh, a Star Wars clip, That what's so big deal about that? The fact of the matter is we're not allowed to show Star Wars clips on uh, on Twitch streams, but I've got a technological workaround that is going to allow me to possibly show you a little bit of Star Wars, which who doesn't like Star Wars? Yeah, we're going to I'm going to give it a few more minutes because I don't know if we're there yet. I'm looking at this. I don't know if we're there. I'll be there yet. Patrick's looking uh, at the number. He's he's scanning that. He's looking right, to see Andy which, Blandy which just gave which. Me 10 bucks. Andy Blandy gave me 10 bucks to kiss Anakin. If you guys can help me. Figure it out. Here we go. All right, hold on. All right, let's do it. All right, hold on. All right, all right. I'm gonna have to move my mic. All right. Yeah. Hold on one second. Now keep spinning. Yeah, yeah. lower. Are we? You guys yeah. to us. That, that chair. That yeah. chair is not your friend in this. That chair is not your friend. Yeah, move the chair. Move the move chair. The chair. Get, get rid of the, the chair. chair. Move the chair. Your mouth you is going to be no, no. Be yeah. Wow. It, he's so I mean, tiny compared to Anakin really... that this looks inappropriate. Wow. But I think that that's going to satisfy some people. That yeah. scratch, that definitely it's scratched it's an edge. That definitely scratched an edge. It's Sorry, challenge. I paid my bill. I paid my bill for that one. Yeah. Yeah. My internet got booted. Can uh can everyone see this now? Are we on the live stream now, or is we're this right, we're on the show. okay? We're and on I can show. Patrick. and I can see this. Yes. Yeah, yeah, you can see you this. Are definitely okay, it. cool, cool. Okay, Patrick, make me full Sorry. screen. Okay, hang on. Give it to Watto, baby. There we Give go. It to we go. There you go, Watto. If someone donates five thousand dollars, I will jerk off Babu's face. Wait, what? What was the last <laughs> word? What was the predicate of that sentence, Watto? Can you repeat yourself? I, clear? I will jerk off Babu Frick if you donate. Babu Frick. Five Frick. I will jerk off Babu Frick. I and he's, in, he's, he's consenting? Yes, he okay, has yeah. enthusiastic consent. I will manually manipulate Babu Frick to order. Better, okay, be, a quick just roundtable discussion between all of us. Uh -huh. Who has a better name? Grogu or Babu Frick? No one beats my man, Babu Frick. Yeah, Babu Frick. That Babu Frick's I, I think, a great name. Those are the two best characters to come out in uh, Star Wars in a hot and a hot. I 100% agree. I, I really wish that uh, Grogu had a last name too. I think it would have been very funny if mm -hmm. it was, I was like, oh, that's Grogu. <laughs> <laughs> that's Grogu Gamat. You know, it's like whatever his name would have been. It's like they have a full name. Like Grogu was yeah, That's Grogu like, Hutchinson. Well, that's, will, Maurice, say, that's Maurice Hutchinson's son. <laughs> Grogu Hutchinson. One of my pitches last week, and this, this idea is out there, I'm hoping it will happen in season three of The Mandalorian, is that they will get David Letterman to come onto the show to introduce Boba Fett to Babu Frick back and forth. Uh, Boba Fett? Babu. Babu. By the way, Babu, Boba, Boba, Babu, 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 Babu. We can do Fat. this. We can do that. We can do this with get that old Oscar footage, get yeah. an impersonator, 
yeah. slap it in. We have we have the talent. Oh, we can do that now. Now, Paul, now you're t that's how you make a movie. That's Just how get, you make get the footage, slap a new person in, slap it in. That's how you make a movie. Just get the footage, add them yeah. in, slap yeah. it in. Oh, man. Can, all right, this is a question I wanted to ask you, George, because uh, yeah. I've been I'm very, freezing. you know, obviously everybody at uh, uh, Radio Land News Network has been really curious about this. You said that Francis Ford Coppola was your inspiration for Han Solo. Do you feel that uh, Harrison Ford portrayed Francis Ford Coppola as an older man when he returned back? I know you didn't have a control of the new films, but did you feel like uh, he embodied the the 2020, uh, you know, Francis Ford? Uh, well, obviously, Harrison's obviously not physically, certainly. I, they don't give off the same vibe. Um, but I, I would say to the extent that you know, Han Solo is a bit of a mess at that point. Right. Mm -hmm. And you, you definitely feel like uh, Ben so Solo turning into Kylo Ren. Like, that's like Francis directing Jack. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, you look at the movie Jack, and that is like, oh, this is his Ben Solo, Kylo Ren. This is a disaster. This is one of the worst movies you've ever seen, and Cosby's in it. I don't want to make it... I, look, I don't want to make it dark, but obviously, you know, Coppola was working through the death of his own son by killing his daughter in Godfather Three, and I, I feel like, you know, some might say that uh, that J.J. Abrams just lifted that story from Francis Ford Coppola's life and kind of redid Godfather Three mm -hmm. at the end of uh, at the, the end of the first one. Yeah, yeah. You, yeah. Once yeah. Gabriel comes back, I want to give a I want to give a money update. I think it's time. I know we lost him, but I think he'll be back in one second. I bet he'll be back. Look at that. I, I, I got, yeah, he'll be back. I got the sequel hat ready to go. I yeah. want to do an episode two. I love to do an episode two. All right. So here we go. Watto, do you want to count? Let's all count down from five, and then I'll bring it all up. Right. Five. Five. Four. Four. four three, three. I think Gabriel's is still frozen. Two. two one. one. Machi, 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 machi. Hey! We did it. We did it. Does that we mean I got to? I got to go put the kettle on, right? Oh. Yeah, we'll put the kettle on, George. I'm way ahead. All wow, right. Wow! Well, wow! Wow! So let's. I mean, let's start. Wow. Take me full screen. Take me full screen. Oh my god, coming in so hot. That's right. We did it. We fucking did it. We made the money and we're here. We're talking tea with Zooks and the boys. Guys, I'm not gonna lie. You can you can minimize me now. You can minimize me now. Oh, I came okay. in came in too hot. No, it was great. It was great. Oh, I love it. I'm I'm yeah, I, I do. Boom. Zooks, what you sipping on? Soothing Soothing. Caramel Bedtime. Ooh. What is support a good night's sleep? I mean, guys, here I am, living the dream, mm -hmm. watching you guys crush. By the way, happy Mando Monday. Happy Mando oh, Monday. Happy Let's Mando take a Monday. Look. Mr. Oh, Hutchinson. I'm just chilling with my, with my man Grogu. Oh, you got a Grogu too? Yeah. Oh, yeah. What are you talking about? This now, is like everyone... I feel like everyone got Grogu. I didn't get a Grogu. Now, Jason, let's talk about this. Sure. Is that one worth $450? What do you mean? That's how much it is if you want to buy it. Oh, 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 oh okay. I did not know that. Um, absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. It's worth more. I would spend more on it. Is that Apple. a slideshow collectible Grogu? Yes. I believe it is. It is. Oh, man. Yes, it is. It's, it's, oh, it's, it's a Sideshow collectible Grogu. I, I've been at Sideshow. I couldn't get a Grogu. I got to get a Grogu. Can you, <laughs> when is 9 a.m. in Switzerland? That's the new time. <laughs> have, you seen the, have you seen Grogu and Dior? Do you think, <laughs> Paul, you should just tweet, I got to get a Grogu, and I bet they'll send you one. Because <laughs> we have this bullshit $30 Grogu. We're out here doing hours of Star Wars every week. No one sends us a girl group. We have to buy our own girl group. And it's this bullshit that doesn't even have fucking feet. The only I got girl a, group I, got a girl I have. Group. 
was oh, airbrushed yeah. onto a t-shirt by this guy on the Venice Beach boardwalk. And every time I wear the shirt, everyone cool Yoda shirt. And I say, no, it's Grogu. And they're like, on your fat ass? Every <laughs> single person. Gabrus, can you go get that shirt? All right, I'm gonna go get I'm gonna go get my Grogu and I'm gonna also get uh because I have the one that was sent to my children. And oh, of course everybody oh, get this your shit tea. Everybody oh, guys, I got something tea. for you. Okay. Uh, I'll be right we back. Hold get on. the ornament too. Get the ornament. You didn't hear me. Hey, Bruce, you know do what? You want to... Go ahead. What do you want to Zooks? This is your segment. What do you Here's want? the thing? I was here having my tea, and yeah. I thought to myself, I was very tempted earlier when I came in to say McClunky. I was like, you know what? Right now I have a real opportunity. I can, in the span of one week, hold the record for both the longest and the shortest appearance time mm -hmm. on an episode of this show. Mm -hmm. And yeah. that was, I'll be honest, very tempting. Very tempting to like really own and bookend this talk show. But then I thought to myself, you know what? We can raise more money. We can raise more money and we goddamn did it. Goddamn did you it. You motherfuckers, you got it done. And so I was like, yes. I will come back. I will do episode two of Talking Tea with Zooks and the Boys. And I'm thrilled, Wado, that you're already knee deep in tea. Oh, uh, Zooks, I ran off. I got this ready like 10 minutes. Ago. Go look I this. love yeah. it. I, I, I was like, look, everyone else, there's going to be this moment when everyone else runs off to go make their tea. I want to be right there with you. I don't want to miss a tea. What is that? Oh, it's an ornament. That's the ornament. Well, this is George's ornament. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize. I, okay, got it, got it, got it. There are multiple ornaments we're about to see. So this one has a rotating star destroyer functioning like a tree. And then Darth is going to put the Death Star atop the got star it. destroyer like the tree topper. And the stormtrooper is holding a candy cane. I, I'm going to be honest. The scale on this one is all over the place. It's wild. There's there's a lot going on in this one. I mean, look at how small the Death Star is compared to the... The Death Star is so small compared to the Star Destroyer. Yeah. And the fact that neither is as big as e either... I mean, that's just not... That's not even a special story. Can I just say... Just ordinary uh -oh. Star Trooper. Uh -oh. um, I already, uh, ma already I made my tea. my Grogu. <laughs> there you go. This was my bootleg Grogu I got... <laughs> Cute. I got to say, Arthur Gabris sounds a little bit like Grogu. I mean, it's it's not too far away. He's uh, you? he's aging into Gamorian guard pretty hard these days. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see this, but you see the hot steam coming off of my tea. Oh, yeah. I don't think I was able to what do, do it. That what do you got? Thing. What's the tea? Yeah. This is what well, we're talking about. Well, are you ready? Is everybody yeah. sitting down? Are you ready for the tea that I have? Full yeah. screen. Tell us what you're you sipping on. Give him the screen. Whoa! 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 Yep. Huge Whoa. reveal. Yep, that Whoa, was going to be you. that is that is it right there. I knew this when I remembered this. I was like, we got something good. F wow, that's incredible. F what is that? Republic F of Tea? It says. Yes, this is I the child. There. This is the uh, the child green tea, and I'll read you the back. It says, "A long time ago in a galaxy far, far away." After the stories of Django and Boba Fett, another warrior emerges. Uh, the Mandalorian is set after the fall of the Empire and before the emergence of the First Order. Um, okay, and then it just da 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 da. And then it goes, the ancients knew of moments of solitude, calm and mindfulness were the utmost importance. Bright green tea, ginseng, and honey flavor combined for a calm energy and a clear mind, primed to reveal the power that lies within you. Wow. Oh, shit. Dude. Wow. That is fucking intense. So do you think, like, when you drink it, it allows you to like use the force is there any kind of i mean it seems like it seems like it could grab a ball from a christmas tree or something like that i'm sure that's pretty fucking cool yeah mm -hmm. let's t t taste it um i mean some pretty huge reveals in last night's mando or this weekend's mando right well oh, we're not yeah. we're not talking about those yet oh, George, we yeah. can we can george well, I but then I have it. to take my. Then I, I need the countdown. I need to fully go into it, and we'll need we'll need a minute oh, to go Paul through. Paul hasn't it. seen it. Paul Paul, Paul Paul hasn't seen it. But we spoiled some things for Paul, Jason. We spoiled the fact that Size Noodles eats 
Droopy McCool's ass on camera. Yeah, that happens. I mean, <laughs> yeah. and it's like, it's like, it's, you know what? It's everything the fans wanted. <laughs> yeah. I had Juby McCool ass eating hashtag muted. So I was lucky that I didn't get that spoiler. That's something I just, an old holdover spoiler from my old 4chan days, you know, <laughs> back yeah, when I, I hung in the chans. I will say this. Um, we really don't know. And I guess we're saving this for the, the, the Boba series. Like how, what happened in the Sarlacc pit? Is that a mini series? Is yeah. that a Ryan and Murphy that's, mini I mean, series? That's we need to open the book to find out that we got to open the book of Boba Fett. Yeah, I think we, <laughs> yes. we, we, we got to get in there. Yeah, we got to crack the spine on this. Yeah. Uh, so, Paul, you, you know about the book of Boba Fett? Uh, you know what? But you know, uh, wow. enlighten me. Oh boy! Yeah. Oh wow. boy! Oh boy! <laughs> Paul, so make sorry. sure you watch. Make sure you watch through those credits. Is wow. all I'm going to say. All right, all right, yeah, yeah. I got it, I got it, yeah. yeah. And you are also, familiar with what the jackhammer position is. That, uh, yes, because again, I like to, to search on the internet and I, right. you know. I'm right. What about the, do you know what the jag hammer position is? Yes, the, the judge, judge advocate general. Judge advocate yeah, general. Yeah, the TV <laughs> yeah. sex, sex position? Right. Yeah. Do you know my dad when liked you, that show? Because that, that was his when initials. You, <laughs> when you, oh, J-A-G, wow. and it made him like the show. <laughs> um, I will do this. When you come, oh. you say, I object, Your Honor. <laughs> um, your Honor, I, mean, I came honor, Your Honor. <laughs> oh, really, boy. Oh, that's rough. Gabriel, um, you're all frozen. rise. <laughs> Gabriel, your screen is frozen. Gabriel, you're still yeah, frozen. frozen. I fucking, <laughs> am I really? Thank God. Yeah, you're Please, let frozen. me be frozen. No one, no one heard that. Let's oh, all shit. agree that you were frozen. <laughs> okay, if I'm frozen, then that's perfect. I'm sorry if I'm frozen, but I could just sign off and pretend like it's because I was frozen. Man, my computer's not working. Okay, I better get out of here. Why am I fucking doing this for my fucking night? Okay, I'm like the least famous of these three fucking guys. I should be out of here by now. You're talking about oh, shit. I'm sorry. Wait, you're Can talking about George Watto and I? Yeah. yeah. They can't see us right now, right? No, they cannot see. And I can see us too, right? Yeah, yeah. This, this yeah. has been a big source of computer. Okay, cool. Yeah. Sorry, my fucking computer is I'm using my fucking Can I just show you this stepson's this, computer? Yeah. Um, this is just because you brought it up, this is my grandmother, and this is the shirt I got her for Christmas back in <laughs> uh two thousand and three. So here we go. Shit, this is this should be a stretch goal. Whoa. That is uh, my grandma with her Jag shirt. That is a official <laughs> oh my <PBS> God. <laughs> Jag shirt that I was very proud to get her. She's so legitimately that's... happy, Paul. Like, oh, that's the, the face of a happy grandma. She loved the that best Jag thing shirt. about this is how quickly you got that. Oh, I knew it was there. I knew it was there. <laughs> <laughs> all the photos in my, in my, in my phone. It's like in my Jag folder. <laughs> so, wait, so, Paul, you should see we can see your ornament now. It's time to see your ornament. Oh, they have to go get that too. Hold on. Okay. Oh, and I I'm also get my shirt. Are we talking to you? Are we already talking to you or I'm not? Gonna oh, say, I'm so sorry. Can I interrupt you, Patrick? We want. Patrick, can you shut can you shut the fuck up for a second, Patrick? Bryson? Please. Give me full screen. Give me full screen. Give it to Jason. Give him full. Why huh? are you giving <laughs> don't give it an empty cheer? What the fuck? Okay. Give me the bumper. Give me the bumper. <laughs> Give me the bump. Yes! Hell We're yeah. back. Episode two of Talking Tea with Zooks and the boys. George, it looks like you went and got yourself some tea. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Yeah. Uh, this is Twinings. It's peppermint tea. Ooh, I love I that peppy, man. Yeah, it's it's refreshing. It makes you feel it's refreshing. And, and, that's great. And the thing is, Good I'm a storyteller. Digestion. And what I like about this, what I like about this, honestly, back to me, back to me, back to me, Bryson. Yeah, we are on is, you. It comes with the, the twining story. story. The twining story that appeals to the storyteller. I was a today years thing. old when I learned it wasn't Twinnings tea. I guess uh, I've been reading that wrong <laughs> for on, 15 dude, years. Come on. You're just one of those Gabriel, things. You're on episode two of Talking Tea, and you're just learning that now. Yeah, <laughs> I'm a Tazo guy. I'm a fucking Twinning Tazo guy. What happens guy. at the end of episode three? Oh, I'm okay. sorry, Gabriel. <laughs> did you just say you're a Tazo bro? <laughs> I'm a Taz bro. Uh, I don't. You, you know, I know you're from Lo Long Island, but you don't have to be such a Tazo bro. Bro, we were big Tazo bros growing up in my hood. If you didn't don't have a black afraid, tea with a passion fruit that, drip, don't be afraid of that Yogi baby. 
Damn, son. Am I now talking tea? Because my doctor yes, says I have low you're tea. You're on the show, Gabrus. Go and get your tea. You can see me? Yes, yes. we can see you. You're doing great. Go get your tea. And the crowd can see all real. this shit, too? Okay. Get all right. Yeah, hold on. Let me get a tea. We, I thought I was we did, I thought I was in the green We did a real disservice to Gabrus in explaining to him when he could and could not be seen. I genuinely am concerned that Gabrus has not known he's been on this whole time. <laughs> no. Back to George. George. Tell me about this Twinings. You love the peppy. You love the mint. You love its, it's refreshing pep- nature. Do you feel like it's in, it's giving you that drive to drive forward and, and collect do. more money? In 1706, Thomas Twining started selling fine tea in England. Today, yes, a visionary like yourself. <laughs> today, so it's a hard, that's a hard cut from 1706 to 2020. Today, you know, Twining a hard still sells. Position. Still sells some of the world's best teas from the original store in the Strand, London. Well, presumably not. I mean, I don't know what their mail order or um, curbside is like. And in more than 100 countries throughout the world. I'll admit, impressive, not a great story. You know, the the story starts with that the guy started selling tea, and then we cut to hundreds of years later, and they're still selling tea. Here's what I'm going to say, George. Let's punch that story up. All right? (laughs) We have so many of the elements. We have so many. We have we have an outline. Let's like let's let's tell. I would say why not why not consult Joseph Campbell and his hero's journey to make that finding tea story better. Oh Oh, shit! What what do we got here, Gabrus? What does this say? This is a little twinings. I thought it was twinnings. I've been calling it that for a year. But if y'all want to, you know, if you want to fuck around, honey, vanilla. If you want to fuck around and find out, I got that Yogi. Yeah. You know I'm a Tazo, bro. You know I'm a Tazo, bro. Oh, bro, cla- a, a little, tazo. a little classic. If you want to try to fuck Ooh. a British broad, got that and then, Jeep. and that if the if the girls come over, she got bad breath. You make her one of these. She goes <laughs> fucking <laughs> wild, bro. Okay, can we not do any Star Trek stuff on the show? <laughs> what? Yeah, Earl Grey is more of a Star Trek thing. That's uh, I just want. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Um, uh, I think you got to make that chamomile vanilla, Gabrus. That's the that's the move. This is one of For my this? favorites. Also, by the yeah, way, when I ran out one? to get. When I ran out to get these teas, my wife's asleep on the couch with the food we ordered for dinner. <laughs> it's like I'm like, what am I doing? And she's like, oh, like she like oh, wakes up and I'm like hey, running hey, with the tea. Hey, my... hey, <laughs> oh, my let me get the is... dog. Let me get the dog. It's for a fundraiser. Jesus. My my wife is so upset with me when I ran down. She's like, everything okay? I'm like, yes. I just need to get the Mandalorian tea. <laughs> <laughs> It it takes that it takes that like uh, astral projection view to see yourself what you're doing, but you need your partner's eyes every once yeah. in a while to be like, oh, I'm 300 pounds tiptoeing with a bunch of boxes of teas in my hand <laughs> to show you guys the boys, Zooks and the Zook, boys. Zooks need to seize his tea. I think it's something. <laughs> I have to something about tea. I always just Watto, roll with hang it. On. Gabriel, hang on, Watto, go full screen on Watto. I'd like to share a little story. (laughs) The story of Bigelow Raspberry Royale Black Tea. And this is how you tell a tea story. (laughs) Thank goodness for that little jar. When Ruth Campbell Bigelow started Bigelow Tea in 1945, (laughs) the going was tough. This is why I started this part of the show. She <laughs> created a wonderful you. tea. Constant comment. But now, had to sell it. One store at a time. Wow. Yes. One day, one day she visited a store that had begun to successfully sell her tea. The shopkeeper shared with her that he had been opening up a container to allow his consumers to enjoy The tea's amazing aroma, one whiff, and they were sold, he said. Ruth immediately started including in each case an extra little jar of constant comment, labeled (laughs) open and whiff. Wow. Shops across the country place this whiffing jar, a whiffing jar by their cash register. This would prove to be a defining moment that helped grow our family's tea company into the success it is today. Thank goodness for that little jar. Sincerely, the Bigelow family. 
and that's the T. Yes, play the bumper, goddammit! Yeah. Play the bumper! Beautiful. Beautiful. That's what I'm fucking it talking about. It had an arc. It had an arc, that story. It's got a beginning. It's got a middle. It's got an end. Bigelow is out here in these just crushing it. I feel like we just heard the fourth, fifth, and sixth stories of Raspberry Royale uh, yes. tea. And I hope yes. to eventually someday hear the first through third. And then someday way later, the seventh through ninth. Yeah. It's a saga. It's definitely, that's a tea saga. What Twinings is offering is it's a humble, it's a brag. There's no story to it. Guy starts selling tea hundreds of years later. It still works. Where's the drama? Guys, I didn't have any, I didn't have any tea. Patrick, you don't have any tea? tea? All right, Patrick. You have hot hot chocolate? Are you 13 years old, Patrick? Oh, this is upsetting. Patrick, do you have anything in your kitchen that starts with the letter T? Can you put a Scrabble tile T in a mug, you goddamn moron? I, I, I have, I have, I'm sorry, Patrick. I don't mean to interrupt, but I just saw, I was looking at my T. Looks like <sighs> Moff Gideon put a tracker on my T. What? <laughs> yeah. Oh, Moff Gideon put a tracker on the bottom of my tea can. Even after what happened to him last night? Huh. Oh. <laughs> I can't believe he can still walk after that. He'll be back. He did it before last Never night. Never mind. He plays the box so well. Yeah. Oh. Um. I've, by the way, also, I'm seeing, and this is for the people watching, which I'm, I'm assuming is thousands at this point. Yeah. Correct. I've seen zero fan art. We've really we been had more uh, fan art for talking bread than you guys have for talking tea. And no, talking we, bread, we never I even mean, did. I'm, I'm talking from the fans. I want fan art of Sheer, Gabrus, and myself in, in Stormtrooper well, uniform. Boom, Patrick. Yeah. Patrick, I, I think since we haven't really been looking at the fan art today, I think Patrick, yeah. I think you could start to really take us on a tour of if you go to the media yeah. tab. Just start pumping that fan art and 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 show Paul what. There's what, the uh, there's the spoiler of Jenny Slate as Lobot from this week's. Oh yeah, Sorry, Paul. Hey, that's You'll... great. Uh, that's let's great. see what that else we got. One. Let's see what else we got. Hang on. Oh, here's a here's one. Uh, I don't know if this was made last week or this week, but finally, yes, I wanted oh. to be holding a lightsaber, and I'm in Jedi robes. I look better that's than you. Mace Windu. Good, Jason. Shot from Mike fire. from Mike Lau. Um, let's see if we got any other ones. I believe this was from before you guys came in. Uh, but this is from uh, Kevin on video. Let's say. Uh... Oh, yes. <laughs> I love that. I love that. I love that. The, the, the perfect ski slope nose. That's what I would say. Yeah. Uh, that's all we've gotten while you guys have been here. Yeah. Well, I guess I owe oh, a couple of questions. We have a request. Now. We have a right? request. Yes, but what, let's make it clear. We want people to submit artwork of the tea troopers. The tea troopers. Abris, Sheer, yes. and Zeus. The tea yeah. troopers. The tea troopers. <laughs> yes, absolutely. That's the, like that's. By the way, that's the twelfth uh, Star Wars show. Oh, after I the fucking bad, hope that, so. after and we all the bad, wear bad, mugs over our troopers. head. We all well, wear mugs other. overhead so you can't see our faces. Jason, this is a good question for you. Uh, somebody, yeah, go for it, I, I want to see Jason in Star Wars. But I, when people look, let's be honest right now. We can all have this honest conversation. If they were to offer you a role in Star Wars, yeah, would you? And, and I know that you would probably say yes based on the part or anything like that. But I'm just talking yeah. about in the purest sense. What would be the era? The, the like the 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 part of the world that you would like to be in. Would you like to be in? Oh, like I, like the the Force Awakens yeah. world. Would you like to? Be, yeah, where like where we're in the trilo- We're in the timeline. Oh, if I could choose any time or yeah. Yeah, like, what's what active, do you mean? What's want? active currently? I I would say it's a tricky. Question. I mean, Just, listen, I'm not going to get it. it. I'm not going to get it. But I want listen. I want to be Thrawn. I said it last yeah. week. Make uh, me Thrawn. Yeah, I got one side. It's right. never gonna happen, uh, you know. And there are so many more people who could be better at it. But I'm just putting my hat in that ring. I'm not saying. Ooh, listen, I'm been, not saying I haven't been yet? 
approached what have they been like no one is mean, obviously no one's been cast I've, he's been mentioned but like has there been any rumor mills uh yeah. so you know like there's only some fan art only, only okay. some fan there art that a, I solicited on this program last week. There was a um, there was a very hyper realistic picture that came out from Celebration last year at a, mm -hmm. on a billboard, and everyone was like, "That's just Pierce Brosnan." Like you just painted Pierce Brosnan blue, and it was like uh, official <laughs> official Lucasfilm fan. Well, that's pretty good. But that's look good. at that. <laughs> we got to lose the beard, though, Ziggs. Would you shave the oh, beard? Of course. Yeah. 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 I think someone. <laughs> the someone JD Harmeyer from Howard Stern show. <laughs> <That's nice. laughs> oh yeah. Total uh, slam on JD. one from Ricky Barty. Let's let that one <laughs> That's good. That's yeah, a good not, one. Not loading, but. Um, there was, but a, also there was a beard question. question. Yeah. I would also be thrilled to be a voice actor in, um, in like, more, if they do more Rebels. Like, I would be, yeah. like, the stories that I love right now are Mandalorian and and kind of what's currently been happening. Clone Wars Season 7 this year was one of my favorite things. Uh, Rebels. Um, those are the, those are the Star Wars that. worlds I'm interested in. Would well, you say what me, I, like, the whole thing is like I wouldn't say no to anything, but at the same time, I don't want to be one of those people who like Mando goes to their village for a week and like fix it fixes a treehouse. Like you oh, know, yeah. I, I, oh, yeah. I also lobbied for myself to be Kane and Jarrus. Yes, yeah, uh, which from I'm that, very into. That's great. It's from bots, yeah. Um, I would very much be into playing Kane and Jarrus. Um, but I looked it up. He's much younger than I am because I was I like, mean, "Oh, he's an older Jedi." No, I ILM, ILM has the answer for that, Jason. <laughs> oh, I don't know the, if they. Oh, I don't know. ILM if they has do. it locked and loaded. <laughs> just they can give you dot, the full dot, Irishman. Dot, they can make you look like you are a young person. Is it Mando Monday yet? Because <laughs> I are. We are Mando that Monday. is topical. <laughs> I, have, I, have, I, have, I need, to, but I need to, I need to like bring it out. And this is the same issue I have with the Marvel universe, and I hate to bring that up. On the show, but there are not many uh, bald characters in the world of Star Wars or Marvel, if, unless you're Sam Jackson. After you yeah, get yeah. Sam Jackson out of the mix, I mean, Tamora Morrison, I guess, is about as close and as you get. get Professor Jabba, X Pen Jabba's bald, right? Jabba the Hutt's bald. And Jenny and Jenny Slade took Lobot. Yeah, <laughs> Lobot's, Lobot's bald now. Oh, Wait, God. George brought up a good point. George, George brought up a good one. Yeah, Jabba, Jabba the Hutt's bald. <laughs> Well, I mean, yeah, sure. I get, yeah, you're right. I mean, yeah. And completely okay, yeah. shaved and completely shaved. I Over. would watch Paul Shear star in a young, like, Riverdale take on young Jabba. Young Jabba? Just yeah. sexy uh, fucking right. young. I just mean, to mischief. Let's, My dad. Let's, big mafia let's see guy. it. Let's see Sheer, it. I could see you. I could see you Shear as an Imperial. I'll be honest. Oh, I'll take I that. Think, I think you could be like a, like an Imperial. Like I can see you in like, like two in episodes, uh, Two episodes ago, like the Endor the Tarantino esque no scene standoff scene when they're uh, with Bill Burr and oh. I'm forgetting the actor's name. Yeah. He played also the Night King in Game of Thrones. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like I'll I can see you in like a tense like imperial will, vibe scene. Thank you. I I'll will. Take it. I'll take it. I will tell I'll you it. what I would cast you as if I was still if I still had a say in it, Paul. Are you going to still get in it involved? I, mean, I heard that if you could replace Kathleen Kennedy, that you would. That's the only way you would go back in. No, people say that, but I, I'm retired. I don't want to do this. I got my museum. I got stuff going on. You know, I got to do these live streams. Uh, if I was going to cast you, it's a yeah. character that I've considered, but I've never pulled the trigger on. I would cast yeah. you as a completely shaved Wookiee. Wow. <laughs> like, top yeah, to bottom. Like, me. you'd be a Wookiee. Like, you just, <laughs> and it's just a choice. My, it's just like, you don't like that. Yeah. You don't like the feeling all that fur, so we just see you, and it's just like you are completely I'm rebelling. I'm, re I'm rebelling against. Yeah. Like well, because that yeah. that's kind of interesting. Because maybe like Paul, maybe if we're double pit, because I always wanted to play the first half human, half Wookiee, raised on oh, Kashik, wow. but not understanding what it's like to be, you know. And I'm not as hairy yeah. as my brothers. I'm not as yeah, big as my too brothers. hairy to be a human man, but not hairy enough to be a Wookiee. <laughs> Or do I yes, have to really uncomfortable to be in? Do we know? I mean, and also very timely as it is, as we are here celebrating Life Day. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. And I think Holy what shit. would be fun, what would be fun for you is that you are kind of the way you would speak would be like you'd speak English, uh, you, but man. in a Wookiee tone of voice. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, bro. I just go. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it would be as if you were kind of scream oh, growling yeah. every word, but yeah. <laughs> It would sound like, like this, oh, Mr. Lucas. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I am the last one. 
Now wait, we who's the man <laughs> now, dog? Who's the half man, half Wookie now, dog? We actually did get some movement because we pitched Jason for some shows last week. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. There was the one where you were a Jedi auditor. You went around yes. talking to Jedi's. <laughs> Uh, he's basically yeah. just like Scientology putting, putting Obi Wan and Yoda, like basically an internal affairs for the Jedi. Who's I'm basically like, like I'm that. asking I-A-B. Like, I-A-B. Yeah, so you you're a Jedi. fucking rat Jedi. You're a fucking yeah. Jedi yeah. rat. You know, you know Obi Wan you know like maybe, why why he left maybe, Anakin to die limbless on a volcano rather yeah. than murder <laughs> killing him. Hey, guess, you know, guess what? If my position exists, guess what doesn't happen? Ahsoka Tano doesn't get framed for a crime she didn't commit and isn't forced to leave the Jedi Order out of <laughs> nothing but honor. Okay, she can continue to become a Jedi, and it won't be so over i mean we, at the top we've got people at the top who are making bad decisions yoda <laughs> is too often meditating <laughs> being decisive yoda stop meditating. yoda get out of the basement yoda yoda's in the so basement where's about? yoda i want him out of his cave He's I want a debate vision. live. I want to see a He's live a debate with Yoda. Order 66, oh. they know what's happening. Shit's going down, and Yoda's like, no, no, let me think about this for a minute. What? All the thing about, about, the thing about Jedi, Jedi Auditor is that the tone of Jedi Auditor, it would basically be like the wire in the sense that he doesn't <laughs> accomplish any of these things, but we just see this person howling at this system that does not work. Yeah. yeah. And in the I last know, episode of every shot, let's get the knowing wire that they're version. hubris. Their hubris is yeah. the hubris will be their undoing. Yeah, yeah. But then we also pitched. We pitched a show called Star Wars Gadzooks. Mm-hmm. I don't it's, like this show. Now this is it's Josh Gad, hand. Jason Manzukas, a two-hander. Okay. okay, let's just say Josh Gad can't do it for some reason. But let's yeah. say that. Can we find Bye. a fucking sw- okay. a swift okay. replacement? Here's an idea. Here's an idea. Gamberling. Gamberling. Yes, John I Gamberling. love it. I love, love it. it. Here's, here's the love problem it. with that. That ruins the title. And it second of the all, and the, and the second we, is, that guy from Balls no, no, of Fury. No, no. We also if have a show run- <laughs> guys. We have a showrunner on board for Gadzooks. Oh wow! Who? My Mike Mike boy, showrunner from One Day at a Time and Six Mandalorian of a certain age. Man of yeah, a certain yeah, age. Yeah. Mandalorian of a certain age. We yeah. bought it in the room. We bought it in the room. Night to Gadzooks. You bought it in the room. He signed on to yeah. Gadzooks. And here's the and here's right the- that I. A je- I mean, not I yet. Would... Not yet. But Jason, we got them on an overall deal. We yeah. might get you. Do. <laughs> you guys have Mike yeah. Royce in an thing. Once and, 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 all day, uh, he's going to do that deal. Yeah. And then he's just done. He needs. He needs well, this thing. You guys need to sign the WGA agreement first. You're already causing so much <laughs> fucking hot water. <laughs> Mm-mm. Well, here's the thing. Yeah, you know what I say about that hot water? Hand it over. I'll make some tea. <laughs> yeah. And, and we're back the with Doc and T with Zooks and the Boys. <laughs> yeah, let it steep. Okay, so how many do we have? We have one, two. Paul, do you have tea? No. No, yeah. Paul, you brought tea. George, he, do you know, he tea? brought. Uh, he brought, yeah. I got tea. Okay, so so we're saying four is the number. Yeah, seventeen. <laughs> nice. What you count four. Now, but you know, you know what I'm guessing. I'm guessing there's a lot of people out in this audience who are having tea right now. So why don't you take a picture of yourself having that tea and send it straight to Patrick? Tweet it. Let's see if we that. can't crash four, whatever four. his account is. Yeah. Why don't you take the Last Supper picture? And replace all of our faces drinking tea, and then you can mm-hmm. add yourself to it. Yeah. yeah. Can we yeah, change the backdrop, it, it, the backdrop it, it, to be an imperial like star <laughs> screen or whatever? Now I hate to Man, I hate to real quick, but one of our one of our uh, fundraising stretch goals that we hit was a message from a friend, and I want to show that really quick. Uh, Bryson, can you bring that up? Hey, everybody at the George Lucas Talk Show. Happy Life Day, George. Happy Life Day, Watto. Happy Life Day, Patrick. My Life Day wish is that someday I truly hope that I get to meet Rosario Dawson as Ahsoka Tano someday. I think it would be awesome. That's that's what I'm going to use my Life Day wish on. But we know it's never going to happen. All right. Thanks, guys. Merry Christmas. 
What? Did you see wow. that? Whoa, oh, did you see that? That was like the fucking kid in uh, Three Men and a Little Lady. The guy in the back who hung himself. That was that Whoa. scared the shit out of me. Did you actually see that Whoa. Ted Danson did a um he did like a, a live stream and he confirmed that that was someone who killed themselves. <laughs> wow. He finally That was the only finally, thing he said on the live yeah, stream. Now, He's now, gonna now, come here to come clear. People have a bunch of cheers questions for him. He just says was, that and walks. He hit thirty thousand right. dollars. And now and now himself. Ted Danson and Bobby Moynihan. And now Ted Danson and Bobby Moynihan are both on the same TV show uh, coming yeah, out, oh, wow. Mr. Mayor, which just confirms that that guy killed himself if he's showing up in Bobby's videos now. Yeah. Jesus Christ. So we bring up Josh Gad. Then we say Gamberling. Then you show footage of Bobby. Uh, geez, I'm sorry. Well, guess who's here right now, motherfuckers? Gabrus, you're frozen. Gabrus, you're, you're frozen. That's fine. They can't see this part yet. But when we get out there, let me know when we're out there and everyone could see it if I'm choppy, okay? We're still in the green room, baby. We're still in the green room. <laughs> we're still just back here talking now, tea, talking vibes. I love it. Zook's in the boys. Guys, I couldn't yeah. be happier to be here. I mean, it's fucking right. Mando Monday. We're getting it. Oh, just another Bryson. Mando Monday. Yeah, I asked Bryson to put extra heavy metal guitar on it, and boom, he delivered. Thank you, Bryson. Holy shit! I think that was the brown note. I dropped a fucking nugget when that when that tone came ripping in. <laughs> That's right. Everybody <laughs> at home, if you just dropped a deuce, put a penny in the tip jar. Let's get those two pennies coming in. You see me sketch show. Here's your stretch goal. I'll blast a fucking shit in my pants if we get the, <laughs> to, <laughs> to cover the. If we hit, uh, what are we at now? Whatever. I just okay. I'll go. I I shit my pants. So whatever. We can just retroactively when we get back into the live feed. Set yeah. me up for this because I shit yeah. my pants already. So just set me up when we come back live with the That's audience like, and stuff. Yeah, we yeah. get this good angle on it. Right. right yeah. Yeah. Right. Um, I'll push. I'll push one out in the meantime. I'll, I'll really get uh, it going. What ornament in there. do you guys want to see? Do you want to see the Skywalker Ranch? I see, there's a lot of people asking about the ornament. Do yeah, uh, we yeah. want to see the Skywalker Ranch one, or you it. want to see the one that upsets everybody on my Christmas tree? Upsetting there's a lot of people, people asking. Paul says. <laughs> people, I've, I've seen it like three times. Like I wanted to make sure I got it. <laughs> a lot of people are asking. You know? a, lot, a lot of people asking about the ornament. <laughs> All right. So Skywalker Ranch is that what we're showing? Yeah. Upsetting first. Uh, <laughs> Oh, upsetting first. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is upsetting. So this is a motion activated, um, a motion activated uh, uh, ornament, and it's uh, our favorite heroes. And what they're doing is they're guarding the tree. And I'll let you see what happens. So when there's motion by the tree, uh, we get a little of this. Ooh. Whoa. And then and then watch. Then the, uh, that's one. And then here's the other one. Oh yeah, show us both. Goodness gracious, Ardu, what are you doing? Oh. You cannot invite someone to oh. take a peek Just... at these gifts that directly violates our mission. <laughs> you thought I was powered down. I'll power you down, you naughty mischief provoker. Yeah, that's that's and a then, little they have a very kind of they're, they're still going. No peeking. No peeking. No peeking. <laughs> I suggest you recalibrate and shake your data again. I have a good feeling about this one. Money. It never stops. Like, <laughs> it's like, it's, it is while a guy is up. just robbing your fucking house, is that just plays <laughs> not not waking anyone up? <laughs> now, what is it that C three PO calls R two D two because it almost felt like it dropped out as if it was censoring him? You missed yeah, it sounds thing. like Mother Wanker or Mister. It's supposed to. It sounds like a a pun on motherfucker. Wow, <laughs> you Mother Wanker! <laughs> now let's see the uh, let's see the Skywalker Ranch one. All right, so yeah. here it is. Came in a very big box. Wow. Wow. Oh, nice. wow. That is the ring. Does it light up inside? Something's it going on. Oh. It's giving you a little bit of that. Uh, yeah, we, have, we have electricity here. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's pretty cool. dope. 
I have a green That's pepper great. that George sent me this year from the farm on Skywalker Ranch, but I ate it already. Oh. I ate it right when I got it, George. It was delicious. It was crisp. It was yummy. Thank you. By the way, the restaurants at Skywalker Ranch are hands down the best. They have like yes. a Michelin, a Michelin yeah. chef making you meals, and it's like for maybe 45 people a day like there's wow. yeah, it's amazing <laughs> now guys we actually i have a fundraising update that i want to talk about because it's a big one gabrus get ready to shit your pants <laughs> oh fuck i'm on it i walk olive oil i got i got a text right now from tom sharpling friend of the show here we go we're at thirty-two thousand three hundred and seventy-three dollars thirty-six. wow that whoa around when sharpling, we hit 30, sharpling has purchased an irishman not for tonight, but that he can throw down at any time. We have always said that a single three thousand two hundred eighty dollar donation <laughs> means we have to watch The Irishman. We're yes, not going to do it The tonight. Irishman is oh, wait, thirty hours and twenty eight minutes long. You have to watch it as a as a live stream. Yes. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> We've already done this. How many times have we are watched we all, The Irishman? We've already watched The Irishman twice, twice, I think. Are we We've already, done the already <laughs> been paid to watch The Irishman two times on this show? <laughs> yeah. So. I've never seen it. I've never seen it. <laughs> oh. You, well, it, if you've never it, seen it, it, the way you got to watch it is on the George Lucas gotta talk show. It, you got to watch it <laughs> because <laughs> the only way to watch it is part of this show. So yeah, here, you know, here, yeah. here's the message I have to read. Say that I've got an Irishman in my pocket that I can throw <laughs> down at any point, and that we I have need to say to that not, we have to. This is me. I have to say this. He, oh. Tom Sharpling is now acknowledged as the most generous guest in the history of the show. Tom <laughs> really loves to give. It's and, really amazing. And that I'm very sorry that his sign got stolen. His 1600 pen sign got stolen. Um, that's what I needed to say. So All right. So we're so we're at three thirty two thousand three hundred and seventy three dollars and thirty six cents. I mean well, that brings you up over thirty five grand. That's pretty significant. Amazing. No, no, no. Is that, that more than Paul? That is that more than you made in an hour? That is the total yes. with his number in there, Jason. Yes. My mistake. I'm sorry. This yeah. this also means we've activated Watto's wish as a strength. Let's hear it, Lana. Oh, you want to hear Watto's life day wish? <laughs> Oh boy. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> Let me just say something to everyone watching right now. I don't want a lot for life day. <laughs> There's just one thing that I need. I don't care about the presence underneath the life day tree. I just want for my own. <gasps> More than you could ever know. Make my wish come true. Oh, all I want, oh, life day, is you. Yeah. I don't a lot for life day. There's just one thing that I need. I don't care about the presence underneath the life day tree. I don't need to hang my stocking there upon the fireplace. Hasbro won't make me happy with a toy on life day day. I just want to for my home more than you could ever know. Make my wish come true. All I want on life day is you, baby Yoda. <laughs> oh, I won't ask for much this life day. I won't even wish for Snoke. I'm just going to keep on waiting underneath the missile toke. I don't want to make a list and send it to the stream yard for Patrick. I won't even stay awake to hear those magic cat rats click. Cause I just want to feel enough, holding on to me so tight. What more can I do? Baby, all I want all oh, life day is you. Day Yoda. All the lights are shining so brightly everywhere. And the sound of children's laughter, it fills the air. Everyone is singing. I hear those sleigh bells ringing. 
Oh, Santa, won't you bring me the one I really need? Won't you please bring my baby over to me? Oh, I don't want a lot for my day. This is all I'm asking for. I just want to see my baby Yoda standing right outside my door. I just want to for my own more than you could ever know and make my wish come true. Baby, all I want for life day is you. Everybody now. Baby, baby, all, baby, baby. all I want, I want for life day, life day, day is you. Is no baby yoga. All right. I think it sounds good. Whenever you're ready, we could do that live for everybody. Oh, no. I'll back you up okay. on the end there like we just practiced. Wow. Wait, were we not were we not on? <sighs> or no, we're off now. We were just on now, but now we're off. That was great. Wado, that was, that was so good. You know, I mean earlier Wado, you said you were gonna do something that was gonna blow my mind and you fucking did it, bro. You fucking did it. I did it. Wow, that was awesome. Wow, that was tight AF, bro. I very carefully rewrote this song to make it about Watto. I don't know if you noticed that. Oh, no. I I just thought you were singing the regular song. Wait, what were the lyrics? Wait, what song? All all I want for Christmas. (laughs) Yeah, isn't that what you did? Never heard that one. because I did all I I want for life day. I did all I want for life day. Very careful. That song I know. That's the song you just played. What's the other one you're saying ripped you off? All I want for Christmas who gives it. I've huh. never heard of it. <laughs> um, it was beautiful. It was literally beautiful. Yeah. yeah. Let me. Uh, we actually have uh, some more fan art I want to show because we just got a bunch in. Um, finally. Finally. finally nope, fans are getting off their asses. Get it together, you clown. <laughs> uh, There's no way they could be tired for any reason. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, there yes. it is. Oh, shit, dude. Yes. This, that legitimately they, makes me horny. They need, to replace, I mean, they need to replace the helmets with tea or I, like some uh, cups of tea. I do want to say I'm glad I'm not a part of this. Okay? No. I'm happy. Wow. wow. You know what, it. Patrick? You know what? I'm I fine. am too. Me too. Yeah, I am too. It makes okay. me happy. What a great uniting moment. We all, I think, feel glad that yeah. you're a part of it, Patrick. This is what I'm talking yeah. about. Welcome. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Welcome. Okay. Out of a Pyrex? <laughs> yeah, Jesus, bro. Go back. back. My, that go back. Tea out of a measuring glass. Evan. <laughs> measuring cup. What are you wow. gonna, that is what happening? Tea. I need 4,500 milliliters of tea. Stat. <laughs> <laughs> My guy knows his macros. He's like on oh, his fucking. Oh, I like Ooh. Thank you so much. Oh, uh, that's a good one. Uh, is this from my nice. oh, nice. Holy yeah. shit, Paul Shears These on his people computer. people are fucking delivering on team. These are, the heroes. These are the heroes that I'm talking about. These are the people that are bringing the tea talk to this sleepy time talk show. Welcome back. Bryson, yeah. give me that bumper. Thank you. We're Those back. of you who are drinking tea are on the front lines of supporting Talking Tea. So we just want to thank our front line wor- supporters and front line workers That's of right. Talking Tea. Yes. You guys yeah. will get vaccinated the first. The talking tea community is getting the vaccine first. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, is that what you just said, Gabrus? <laughs> oh, I was right behind you. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm still frozen, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's upset their fan art didn't show up. Who? Whose fan art didn't show up? Patrick. I think it's Patrick. I thought Patrick was the one who was upset that his fan art didn't oh, show up. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Michael, who's someone, the cool. George, who's someone the cool. fan art? Hang on. There is another piece of fan art. George, can you show uh, these guys the new social media platform you just joined? Oh, yeah. I'm on TikTok. In your DMs, they say. George Lucas talk shows on TikTok. Hmm? In your DMs. Oh, okay. I'll look in there. That is not what I was looking at. Uh, I mean, we've get only it together, so Patrick. You, you can't be out here just booting people's art. They took the time. Oh, wow. 
This is actually fun. Virtually the talk show is on TikTok. We've only talked one TikTok. <laughs> we have TikTok. Uh... And we're not playing I the music, that, but it's not, that, but that it robot is... at Skywalker Ranch. Yeah. <laughs> That was getting ready to go to the museum. No joke. So, and, and, and if you can if you can hear it, it is playing TikTok by Kesha, so it's even better with the music. Uh, Sometimes you say who is a show for, and then you go, Oh yeah. Oh, me. Oh, yeah. Nice. <laughs> yeah. oh man. Oh, yeah. That's fucking rad, dude. Yeah. Um according to my Instagram discover page, TikTok is exclusively busty female comedians. <laughs> or maybe that's just what I'm getting served due to I'm other sorry. likes or whatever. Sorry. Do I have to join TikTok? <laughs> Here's Matthew Weinstein's oh, Ooh, I love that. That's what Good I'm talking one. about. Uh, Look at the little insignia on the on the shoulder pods. Oh wow. It? Oh, it's a what tea bag. This? The it, it's oh, on wow. the helmet too. I was like, oh sick, a mouse like too. computers, and it just worked for me. And I didn't even I didn't even know what it was. I was like, oh, like a computer mouse. That's dope. Oh, he's, in the, he's a stormtrooper that works with computers. <laughs> yeah. I would like the stormtroopers to have a little bit of pizzazz on their on their, you know, like like the way that a top gun the, pilot would have like a little decoration. Yeah. Like the way the it. fire trooper gets the little fucking red accents <laughs> in Mando. Yeah, I want a little highlight. I want a little accent, a little vapor Another wave vibe. Now, there's actually one more uh, stretch goal that we have not addressed yet, and it's from a while ago, and we said we would get to it, and now it's the time. I'm going to bring in a guest uh, really quick. Uh, let me find the bumper I need to play. <laughs> one I, have a couple of stretch, Patrick, I have a couple of stretch goals Patrick, that I have to start deliver before we're done tonight. It's a great question. <laughs> a <good> question. <laughs> Abigail Bread Challenge. Okay, guys, so this is Abigail, and we <laughs> hey, Abigail. sometimes will bring her onto the show. Because she says, Abigail, correct me if I'm wrong. It's yeah. one piece of white, two yeah, pieces, no, two. two pieces of white bread. Yeah. You have to be able to eat it in under a minute. People under say it's minute. impossible. It's impossible. Abigail has one minute to try and eat it. Yeah. And then she gets booted off the show. I've failed it, many right. times. Uh, is someone you? there in uh, case you're choking? Is there? A, is there? A, you know what? They ask every time, and there never is. Um, do you, Abigail? Do you have? Wait, any... this is not the first time this has happened on this. Oh, no, I've no. I want to point out. I made um. I made a shirt late last night uh, for Abigail's bread challenge. That's great. Nice. Looks like, yeah, looks like it. yeah, Abigail. Well, Abigail, uh, this may be your lucky night because Jason and I are the host of Talking Bread. So, and you know, yeah. together, both of uh, both of us here, we might be able to lead you to success. I'm I'm huge fans. I'm I'm a huge fan of yours. Um, and so I think that that might be the the push. I mean, we we are we we want it. We want it to happen for you. We really yeah. are hoping. Here's that, the thing. You know, my life. We believe in you. you. Yeah, we you believe in you. I've never felt that from Patrick before. Is this Abigail, oh, can I give you a piece of advice? Abigail, the private chat. I'm going to be honest. Patrick yeah. is talking so much shit about how you are not going to be able to do this. I'm not surprised. It's a mess. He, in the private chat, he's like, this cannot be done. Abigail will yeah. not do this. I believe it. And Paul and I and Gabrus are We're giving you a lot of, of good vibes. The she will. energy that I'm feeling is so different than anything I've felt before on this Abigail, show. can I give you just a little bit of advice? Please. I know you've done this three, four, maybe even five times. Sure, yeah. So much so that they don't even upgrade the number of guests when you enter the screen. They just keep it at 87. That's a Bryson thing. Okay. Uh, and so, don't blame Bryson for that. Uh, so, Abigail. Blame Pat Patrick. Blame yeah. Patrick. What I would say yeah. is <laughs> roll up the the bread. Yeah, like, yeah. Like a tube, like a hot, like, um, like a, a, a taki. Uh, and you then together. That's the point. No, one like one <laughs> like uh, one at a time. Your rep. Yeah. Yeah. Roll it up like a talkie. Yeah. And, can I, uh, can I, can can I give a piece of advice? Yeah. Yeah. Let me get. I have a piece of advice as well. Wait. Before I, you do that. Before you do that, Abigail, how do you want to be introduced? Um. Okay. Uh. Let's go with um. Bryson's biggest fan. Wow. Lotto. Okay. And I should just make it clear that none of the conversation that just happened counted because she hadn't been introduced yet. Yeah. But Grogu is in Gragas. It's my great pleasure to bring on to the show for arguably the fourth or fifth time. We've lost track. Bryson's biggest fan, Abigail with the bread challenge. Hi. Oh, well, can I say really quickly before I do that? Um, uh, so I'm Abigail, sorry. real quick. I just yes. have to do some housekeeping with Patrick before we do the bread challenge. Is that okay? Of course. All right. Uh, now, Patrick, 
Uh, are there other guests that are uh, scheduled to come on in the yeah. show, or is this the total? Total. Okay, you need to book another guest because eighty-eight is a registered hate symbol. Uh, hate groups use I'm, it to stand for Heil Hitler. Hitler. Yeah, and I, I hate Nazis. You had I hate Nazis. One fucking you had job, one job. Patrick. Ooh, we got one job. Let me give let our final guest also be a fucking dog whistle to Nazis. It's the only thing we hired you to do, you fucking piece of shit. I might be able to help. Okay. Whoa. I might be able to help. Whoa. Oh boy. Wow. Uh oh. She. I hope she's getting tea. If she comes I back in blackface, I'm gonna lose it. We can't count tea as a guest. We can't count <laughs> oh, tea as a guest. I love tea, tea, but we, we cannot count tea as a guest. <laughs> I mean, it is late. <laughs> yeah. Is it though? Is it though? Because here's what I'm committing to. Wait, I was Five literally like, hours of this show. <laughs> I literally was in my head going, all right, as soon as the next guest comes, I know that's my way out of here. <laughs> like, I just, we have no more guests coming. I was like, oh, I got to make my exit. Well, Gators, I have, uh, I have, Gators, like, you, do I feel like, sorry, go ahead, Paul. Oh, go, go ahead. I was going to say, Gabriel, I feel like you can weigh in on this bread challenge because you, I feel like, are the power hour food eating. <laughs> yeah. Like, you are the most experienced my first on this channel. My first foray into performance was light competitive eating, barroom competitive eating, cafeteria competitive eating was sort of my first foray into uh, That's where know, we public all first speaking. met you. That's where we all first met you. You were Yeah, you, you were, taught you me about the, the Herald circuit. after <laughs> you saw me circuit and we were like that kid's got something. If we can just get him to stop shoving pies in his mouth and instead start saying jokes out of his mouth, yeah. this kid's got something. It was like uh I guess Respecto Montaban used to practice down by the South Street Seaport where I was doing uh you know race a dozen oysters against like Bridge and yep. tunnel guys just making money, and you guys saw that I had some comedy chops. And you were like, we out, "I remember that exact <laughs> night because we came out back where you were having explosive diarrhea against the back wall of that bar. My feet we, were rock hard, gout crystals, diarrhea spraying out of my ass." <laughs> there we go. That's yes. Yes. This That's is what it. I'm talking about. We're sheer. We're sheer. <laughs> I, like, I don't need to be. I don't always need to be in in, in this stuff. I'm here just to listen, guys. <laughs> you got, guys, you got to put Sheer and take Patrick out. What do you? Yeah. You got get Come it on. together, guys. Don't reward Patrick. Oh. I, I want to say Patrick's been doing two things exclusively in the private chat for the last half hour. He's been saying that he thinks there's no way Abigail will be able to eat two pieces of bread. Yeah. And he's been and, saying that we should only <laughs> count illegal votes. Yeah, that's amazing. That is great. Again, yeah. I, I appreciate that. the Tom's of Finland esque vibe you gave us. I'm sort of like. Here's the other thing that I don't understand on the private chat is why is Patrick saying no? 88 is the number we're keeping. <laughs> Four, right. 1488, he keeps saying. It's yeah. fucking. <laughs> He keeps saying, "Oh, there yeah. we go. That's nice. That's, that's nice." Perfect. Why? Why does Patrick keep saying "thx fourteen eighty eight in the chat? <laughs> um, okay. Guys, I, don't, I know that I know you don't like to break in for big news, but wow. um, there's some big news that just happened. Uh, I just saw some big news on online. Let's hear it. Um, thank you for the full screen. Um, John Krasinski has decided to bring some good news back. Oh, oh my god. god. It That's... just launched a holiday special with The Rock. It, it's uh, it, it's up, and people are it it we're we're in a we're this is a big deal. And I think probably it was because of the stimulus package. I'm not sure, but yeah. it all came out. This is part of the happened. stimulus package. This is what uh, people were this fighting for. <laughs> this is part of it. That's I what think... I call very good news about some good news. Bryson, yeah. me. Bryson, we should get a some good news bump banner <laughs> instead of breaking news. We should get a some good news one. All right. Uh, okay. Wait, is this our 89th guest? Wait, this is 89th guest. Abigail, what's, what's your guest's name? This is Fiona. Okay. Um, oh, shit. She's a fiend oh, for truth. And I wasn't going to do this, but I, um, while I was getting her, I also got some tea. Oh, yes! oh man. Hey. And you weren't going to do that? Focus, like, give it, full screen Abigail. Full screen Abigail. Give me the bumper full screen Abigail. <laughs> Um, 
Abigail, <laughs> welcome. You are the first female guest on Talking <laughs> Tea with Zooks and the Boys. Welcome. Thank you. We're going to change the bumper. Bryson's on it as we speak. What's that tea? Mm. What is that? Um, I also got some yogi, and it's yes. honey lavender stress relief. Mm. Oh, that sounds great. That's I bet that yeah. smells great. I, I would get some it. tummy tea for the we're post. Gonna have, we're going to have 90 guests because the other cat has come. Uh -oh, oh yeah! Shit. Yes. Wait, you're oh, telling me yeah. the person the person who calls into the George Lucas talk show multiple times to eat <laughs> bread has cats? Hell yeah, baby! Here, I I also think Abigail, not for nothing. Yeah. That's adorable. I think the Kleenex too. bottle next to cats. That's like a. <laughs> this is like set deck for oh, a rom com really. first act. Yep. <laughs> I think that this tea might yeah. help you with okay. the bread challenge. Yes. I think wetting down your mouth, no yeah. offense, not trying or to be a creep. dipping the bread in. I think like, wetting like, down uh, your mouth might be a good way to quickly break down that um, bread and get yeah. it down quicker. I don't know. Yeah, if, can you dip the bread? Is allowed. You I don't know bread what the like the Like the people do at the uh, Nathan's Hot Dog eating. So, yeah, they, well, so that's the issue. Patrick told me I'm not allowed to do that. Okay. I still say roll Fucking it. Roll that Patrick. bread. Talk that's because that bread. Patrick wants you to fail. I heard Patrick before the whole thing talking to a bookie mm -hmm. saying, no, that's put 10 problem. grand on no way. Yeah. All right. Uh, this is big news. Can I get that breaking news one more oh, time no, again? Get the breaking news again. Breaking news? All right. I just got a, a DM from John Krasinski. <gasps> if you are able to do this, you are going to be added into the holiday special of some good news. No. So that's what's at stake for you right now. Wow. You will be the featured good news. No. Go with it. Okay, Amazing. Abigail. Yeah. We're going to put you in the middle. Oh, can Go I say something really quickly first? Yes, sure. Um, Jason, um, I saw you at a screening of The Long Dumb Road. Okay. Uh, it was fantastic, by the way. And we oh, met you. Really quickly afterwards, and you were very kind. <laughs> thank you so much. Wow. <laughs> Hooray! Now, now not, not nearly happy. like the not nearly like the rude jerk I am tonight, Patrick. You dumb. Fuck. No, I would just say a different kind of kind because I think that being mean to Patrick doesn't really count. Do you know what I mean? I agree. No. He's not yeah. a person. Now, now, can I say something very quickly before the bread oh. challenge? Yes. This yeah, is let's a get warning. A, a couple more quick things in before the bread <laughs> challenge. This is a warning to Zooks, to Gabris, and to Sheer. And if you. We have come across when Abigail is preparing for the bread challenge in the past mm -hmm. is we do things that are too funny while she is trying to eat it. the bread. Right. Okay. It makes right. it more difficult. So no funny business while the bread is happening. We have to be deathly serious. Patrick, okay. you do whatever you want. You can be, you can do jokes and stuff. Don't worry no, about it. No. <laughs> well, you you can sling all the bullshit you want. The rest of us will keep quiet, so Abigail doesn't have to worry about comedy, and she can just um, focus on her task. Great. Focus on the bread and me. Focus. Uh, on the I don't bread. understand why Patrick's in the chat being like cats aren't people. The real number is still eighty-eight. <laughs> wow. I don't get that. I really don't. I think it's weird. I think it's like an agree. It seems to be pushing an agenda. It says cats and something aren't people, but it's asterisk out because I guess the chat doesn't allow it. So I don't even know what the other word uh, Patrick's and using keeps, is. And he keeps typing "wattos will not replace us." <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck! Uh, it's almost eleven p.m. here. I haven't ate dinner. My wife's asleep on the. Oh, oh, I have, oh, I have a major thing I need to hand in tomorrow, and I'm keep on I'm balancing so how long I can stay. Hey, Patrick, why hasn't Neela been counted? It should be 90. Wow. Wait, your cat's names are uh, Naomi? Oh, sorry, Fiona and Mila? Fiona and Neela. And oh, Neela. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right, Fiona George, let's get the order in for dinner, Gabriel. Sorry, Patrick, can I quickly refresh my screen because it's being weird? Sure, go ahead. Uh, mulberry pizza, Paul. Ooh, so nice. Beverly, yeah, it's you like know, they had... That, that that is good. I like that good pizza actually. Ooh, look, I do. It's good. It. But did you know that uh, that Home Alone did a pop up this weekend? They had a little Nero's pizza, and you could get your pictures with the wet bandits. What? Yeah, the <laughs> real one. Jo Joe Pesci uh, and Daniel Stern. <laughs> yeah, you could. Well, Pesci would Stern wouldn't do it, but Pesci would. Oh, weird. And Pesci would and, only Pesci would only sing jazz uh, standards while while uh, like. Guys, do yourself a record and go to Spotify and listen to Joe Pesci's <laughs> jazz standards. They're incredible. There was a time when like, like Joe Piscopo 
and and uh and joe pesci released albums unironically bruce willis as well oh, uh, Seth mcfarlane yeah. Seth MacFarlane oh, yeah. put out like an, i believe a number of big band oh, jazz i feel I like there's an age frank sinatra and he did an hour an hour <laughs> and it was a tribute to uh count basie frank sinatra and his orchestrations with count basie and then seth mcfarlane came out there after they had been just singing the praises of count basie and he goes you know, a lot of people like Count Basie, but truly Frank Sinatra was best with Nelson Riddle. And tonight we're going to do some Nelson Riddle uh, arrangements. But <laughs> why are we here? Why are we here? Why are we shitting on that? We're saluting this man, Count Basie, wow. not Nelson Riddle. What's the magic a... age and net worth that white men in Hollywood get to before they spin off to jazz and blues musicians? Right. I feel like every one of our guys that you've ever liked watching in movies growing up is eventually like, bad news, so Someone gave me a fucking harmonica and now I'm this guy. <laughs> it's basically like what you would do in your bedroom when you had a guitar. Like, you know, it's like, well, they're in my bedroom now. Well, it's, it's gotta be a it's got a finance, it's gotta be a financial amount of money that you hit when when your agent says to you, Oh yeah, I'm sure somebody would give you a record deal. <laughs> yeah, right. Because you know they're asking. Wow. They're asking and just pr previous to that or just being told, oh, will, no, no way. Uh, I will say yeah. this. Uh, I will say this. The only thing about Joe Pitchcock is that I feel like he tried this first and it didn't work. And then he got into acting. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, wow. Can, can you pull the uh, Leonard Nimoy one? Because the Leonard Nimoy one with yeah. the two sides of the block is always pretty amazing, too. Sure. Let's do Let's do this first. Let's do the bread challenge and then I will pull up Nimoy just so we can get this. Yeah, yeah, of course. Of course. Thank you. No, uh, Rick Moran is a jazz album. I think actually Rick Moran did a cowboy album. He does. He did a cowboy did album, two, and then he did a, an album. Cowboy album. Yeah. Yeah. Abigail via con Dios. Wait, wait, are we starting? Oh, we're is, gonna. Is Abigail's thing frozen? Oh boy, what a disaster! I mean, this is not the way, the way I want to see this. I I, I, I I feel like this is Gabrus's fault. Yeah, I guarantee you that's me. All right. So if that's me fucking up, I'm sorry. So when we get out there and actually do the bread eating thing on live stream, let me know and I'll, I'll you know, I'll shut off. I'm downloading a bunch of bit torrents in the background here. <laughs> you're downloading, you're ripping a bunch of Hallmark. I'm trying to get the raw right? Mando files. I'm trying to get the raw Mando visual files right off the volume. Straight from the Direct, volume. <laughs> straight from the volume. <laughs> Someone I've else a, watched. I've What's the name of that from series? The board, gallery. <laughs> gallery. The most oh, impossible to remember name. It's just like it's like my something called mean, new releases. All the same albums. They're all pretty much the same. I think that they're oh, a lot of them are re-releases. Oh, There's man. so many. There's oh, so many. I, I lost my virginity to the back. Bilbo Baggins song. Yeah, boom, my first boom. fucking nut inside raw no, ever that's was not the, true. No, that's not true. Oh that would God. be incredible. There was a man who had a little head. Uh, like it's like the best song. Bilbo. Bilbo. Bilbo, Bilbo Baggins. Baggins. <laughs> the wild frontier. All right. I'm yeah. going gonna, gonna, to, while we're waiting, oh, can, I tell funny, can I tell a funny Leonard Nimoy story really quick? <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then so, the Paul. Paul, we just don't have time. I'm sorry. Oh, We're out sorry. Of time. <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> oh, Spo is back? Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Wait, wait, wait. Well, yo, happy oh, life. Oh, party you day, baby. Spo. Wait a second. Spo, you're wearing sunglasses, and I don't think we're after hours. Is oh, that happy? Connor O'Malley or Spo? I can't tell. <laughs> happy life of the party day, baby. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. The, the, last time, the last time bitches be horny for Spo was on this stream was, I believe, uh, 15 hours ago. <laughs> and she was yeah. drunk then. Yo, she I was need drunk to... then. Still drunk now. I'm here for a COVID test. I've been, li I've been in line for 15 hours. Oh, no. This is not a test or a vaccine. Me. I just want the test. I don't, I'm not taking a vaccine. I'm just going to test myself every day. All right. So just do me a favor. Pull up here. Roll down your window. Close your eyes and pull your nostrils apart as much as possible. And we'll. Oh, uh, I'll can, I give you my, can I give you my ass nostril? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if you have one big ass nostril, that's just easier for me to check oh, real quick. Abigail's back. All right. Well, let's do this All bread right. challenge. George, <laughs> turn up your watch. Bryson, ready the music. Spo, don't make her laugh. Can I drink? During it, like, can I? Hey, whatever you got to do to get, you got sixty seconds. Whatever you got to do. Okay. 
Let's, George, you tell us when to start. That's what Patrick says to all his ladies. <laughs> you got 66. Patrick, you, Patrick, you also have to update the guest count. What the fuck? Spoh's already been, uh, bitches be horny for Spoh's already been. Oh, oh, sorry, yeah. sorry, sorry. We're double sorry. dipping. We're double dipping. All right, we're gonna go at that. We're gonna go in fifteen seconds, okay? Okay. okay. All right. Abigail, Everyone. you got this. That's Abigail, you got this. Remember, I believe in you, like Abigail. I believe in you. Roll it like a talkie. Oh, John. Okay, yeah. Two, one, go. Wait, she did? What happened? What happened? She did? Did she choke? What happened? She didn't they do said, it. They said bread is the new smoking, dude. You got to be careful. She didn't Fucking do it. Killed she, her has, instantly. she has one she minute. Oh, she, guys, it took, she took way too. The, the first 25 seconds was a wasted amount of time. She the energy was not representative of the task for sure. I got to yeah. say. I got to say. If it's, I understand if it's, this is her mo like a bunch of chances at it. Gabriel, are that, you willing to work with her? Are you willing to work with her, Gabrus? Uh, <laughs> yes. If she's comfortable with that, and I understand if she's not, I am completely willing to work with her, demonstrate what I'm capable of and how you can achieve maximum disgustingness with just the simple human body. People have challenged me to try it. Should I try it? Yeah, of course. All right, I'll do it. I'm gonna get my bread. Hold yes. on. <laughs> you got your white bread. All right. Well, if Paul's gonna do that, I'll jump into the live feed right now, and uh, you know, uh, for the people that are watching and stuff, and I'll yeah. tell them, I'll jump out yeah. there with them and talk about Abigail and the bread challenge and how I'm gonna mentor okay. her for the. Okay, later so on. you'll right. you'll you'll run the show for a while. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah. take over the show for a little bit. I'm just gonna jump in the yeah. other room, okay, right, great. George? Luck, George, yeah. I miss yeah, you, I'm bud. Wado, always a pleasure. Bitches be horny for Spo. Keep, please give day. my best to my happy fellow. Happy Mando Monday. Yeah, happy, happy Mando, Mando Monday. Monday. I got to go uh, update my vest bar. All right, I'm going to go run the show. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great stuff, everybody. Great stuff. Really good great stuff. stuff. I missed uh, what prompted this haircut, Patrick? What was this about? We hit 24,000. And Got I it. said, I said, I'll shave my hair. And they said, well, not all of it. Yeah. Can I ask this question as well? Yeah. Is there a stated goal for this fundraiser or is it just a time limit goal? However time. much we raise in that time. Okay. I mean, the goal was 20,000. Oh my God. So shattered. Shattered. Yeah. yeah. But let's, okay. let's look at the scoreboard before Paul does the bread challenge. Let's see where we're at. We're at 32,373, I believe, right wow. now. That's right. our most recent update. We haven't gotten one new donation. We're actually, hang on. I apologize. That can't be right. That I was apologize. We are at 32,473. Okay. Oh, can, can I get, a little, can I get a little money here to do the bread and, challenge? A yeah, little bit of I money think, for the bread challenge. I think here, we've got to get up to like 34. Wait, what is it? 34 grand. In we are at 32,473. Yeah. You want another 1,500? Yes. It does if feel people good, want to see the bread challenge. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Just I don't want to be, like, I don't be in America. This is about do, you feeding America. That, do you suspect that whoever is left are people who've been here all along yeah. and have already yeah. donated yeah. a lot? I think there are yeah. more people donated their amount. When, when I first started, yeah. started this chat with you all, there is more people here now. This is a moment. Oh, Again, I'm going to give you a, Yeah. Thank you, Paul. Yes. How many people are in here right now? Because we did it successfully last week. 500? 556. Okay. Every single one of you motherfuckers. Give me the screen! 
Give me the screen. Every one of you motherfuckers out there, I want you to text someone, tell them this, text them the link to this goddamn mess, send it to them, tell them if they don't log on right now and give a dollar or two dollars or whatever the fuck these morons are up to. One dollar. That's what we need from you. I want there to be a thousand people in this stream. If there's a thousand people in this stream, I will give a thousand dollars. Pop it to me. Pop it to me. Pop it to me. If we can get a thousand. Here's the deal. Here's the deal. I know a lot of people are like, well, I already donated. I already donated. <laughs> Give me one more dollar. Give me one more dollar. If everybody here gives one more dollar, we're that's almost a thousand dollars. Well, not almost. It's if like, you give two dollars, it'll be a thousand. Give me the screen. Give me the screen. Oh, Give, me dollars. The screen. Give me the screen. Give me the screen. Oh God. This was a mistake. <laughs> Yo, can I get a COVID test or what? <laughs> Give us that nostril. Give us that nostril. <laughs> oh, the ass nostril. Hold on a second. Oh boy. Oh no. Oh no. All right. I'm gonna okay. I'm gonna give a give I'm gonna give a little geostorm emoji give me, out here. Give me the screen. Give me the screen. Okay. <laughs> Zooks has said that if we can get one thousand people watching the stream, he will donate one thousand dollars himself. Mm -hmm. I want to say. If Zooks donates one thousand dollars, <laughs> I will donate one thousand dollars and one cent. <laughs> what? Wow. What? Wow. What? A, what? Wait, and to be clear, you said dollars, not credits, right? Dollar. But to be fair, the the trend, the uh, it's like one to one at this point. But I will donate one thousand dollars and one. We're up to five eighty one. Five eighty one is in the chat right now. We can do this. We can. You guys have the power. You have the power. You know people yes, who are still I'm awake. Think about people you know on the West Coast if you're on the East Coast. Mm -hmm. Think about people who've already woken up in Australia that you know. Get these I mean, out of I'll bed. Say this. I'll say this. Five of the six of us are on Twitter. If we put it on Twitter, I bet we could do this. All right, let's do it right I now. See, I see the numbers going up very quickly. We're at 604. We gained 50 just in the last minute. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. This is the power we have, guys. This is the power we have to change people's lives through feeding America. And how that's much we're gonna for, if right? we get if we get a thousand people in the chat, we're gonna get two thousand more dollars, which means how much more money for feeding America? Two thousand. How much is oh. it gonna be the total total? total? Uh, that'll be like uh thirty-four thousand four hundred and seventy-three. And the penny. And a Don't forget the penny. I'm seeing people logging on here saying they're on, they're donated. I'm seeing people saying we're doing it. I'm looking at the chat. You can talk to me. Prove you brought a friend. <laughs> you motherfuckers, if we don't raise this money, if we don't get a thousand people in here, the Chiss Ascendancy is going to take over our planet. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. If you want Thrawn running the show, that's what's, that's what's going to happen. I'm seeing 643. We've gained almost a hundred. Okay, I'm gonna I'm, I'm I'm tweeting right now. Hold on. Oh, she hasn't even tweeted it yet. No, wow. I haven't tweeted it. I tweeted twice. Uh, once once scum. Once to my Twitter and then once to live, right? That's right. Yes. Get that tweet out. Live. Here, get that tweet That's out. Right. I am. Keep getting those numbers up. Keep getting those numbers up. Keep getting those numbers up. Yo, is that bitch horny for me or what, George? <laughs> Oh, you, you know uh, what? Yeah, I just hit that vibes are, are real, real cool. Oh my! I'm God. into this. Uh. <clears throat> I'm talking about. Listen, we need to get people, We need to get more people watching this live stream than ever watched the Chris Gethard show. Boom! Uh, oh, we already did well, it. <laughs> we're there. We're there, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> If you get, if we can get a thousand people in this room, Paul and I will reveal what was in the dumpster. In the dumpster, uh, we'll talk about it for the first time. Exclusive. Oh yeah. Uh, what is what is the number that everyone is seeing? Because I'm seeing. Five, I see six hundred sixty-four. Six seventy-seven. Okay. Oh my gosh! It just jumped up a bunch. Uh, that's six. Yeah, seven, that's what I'm talking 79. about. Text your friends. Text your family. All they have to do is log on. Some number of them are going to end up giving a dollar. Hey, okay, here we go. 
hey, maybe you just got to the fucking show. Welcome, dummies. Okay. Yeah, Here's what's going about. on. We're raising money for Feeding America. Have I been a part of this show? Am I even related to this show? No. I would I argue. I would argue at this point. Yes. This point. I just All sense right. that these people are tired, and I All right, have I just sent out two big energy. tweets. Two big right. tweets from how did this get made, and from us. And now I'm going to. Uh, we are over seven hundred. Seven hundred. Seven hundred. Okay, and now. We have to put some now. I am going to be eating this bread for charity, right? This is part of it too. Like we, I want to make sure we're selling it the right way too. You know, people need yes. to know. Yeah, it's this fun to watch. Bread, and it, I wanted, I want it known this is bread you were gonna donate, but now yeah. are instead going to eat as some mm -hmm. sort of dare. Mm -hmm. Some sort yeah, of dare. You want. you want to get you want to get people to watch. Say, hey, watch this. A rich white man's gonna eat two pieces of bread to feed America. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I agree with the people in the room, in the chat, who are saying that I do more work for this show than Patrick. I yeah. do. Wow. Yeah. That is. Give me his salary. Patrick's salary to Zooks. That's the hashtag. Whoa, 721, baby. But I do want to say also, welcome to the new people. Please yeah, donate. What's going on. Yeah. Please some donate. Of you, some of you have no idea what's going on. There's a well, donate button. 753. We're yes. raising money for uh, Feeding America. You can donate at bit.ly slash GLTS gives, or you can donate directly to Feeding America and email the George Lucas talk show at gmail.com. Send your receipt. Those are the That's two ways. What I'm to do. Talking about. Guys, I know you're tired. I know you've been giving, you want to give up. I know you, I sense the desperation, the mm -hmm. people who yeah. want to just give up and go to sleep. And to you, I say, just hold on yeah. a little bit longer. Hold on. We are Let's almost send there. A, send a few longer. more texts. Tweet it. Instagram it. I'm Tell people it. to tune in. Mm -hmm. Do it for Grogu. Guys, do it for Grogu. Do it for Grogu. Do it for Grogu. Yeah. If you're going to do it for anybody, do it for Grogu. Oh, well, give me the screen. Give me the screen. Bitches be horny for Spell. Bitches be horny for Spell. Okay, go back, go back. Hit my bumper. What's my bumper? Is this a freestyle? He's more of a bumper. He's Okay, I just this is what I'm two. talking about. Boom. Boom. We're moving yeah. in large chunks. This is all it takes. We're here. Drive, we're here. We're here. Commitment, courage. These yes. are the hallmarks yes. of heroes. And lest you think otherwise, you people at home tonight are heroes. We are raising Tell money everybody what's in at, America. Here, what, what is at stake here? We are almost at $35,000. If everyone even just gives a dollar right now, it's even going to get higher than that. Uh, I still and, want, if we can get to a thousand people in this live stream, yeah. But I'm saying people are jumping dollars. in right now. Let's like get them in and get them invested. Oh yeah, get too. them in, get them in, get them invested, get them donating. But if we get a thousand people in this room, I'm giving a thousand dollars. Watto's giving. He said, I think nine hundred ninety nine dollars. We're giving one thousand and one penny. Wait, what? One thousand dollars and one penny. Oh, Watto's being very competitive with my generosity. So, so <laughs> I will give a thousand and one dollars we're at 851 851 we need to get we need to get this number up we need to get it to a thousand people cents in here more than water if we get a thousand people and in here right now that means that Jason will give total. a thousand. i am upping my total i will give one thousand <laughs> And sixty nine dollars. Oh, just because it on Discord, classic too. Watto perv oh, move. Bitches be horny for. Oh. <laughs> I know. Right now, there really? is a percentage, and we don't know what it is. Who are just here for bitches be horny for Spo and are staying yeah. just because of this content, which is something we okay. haven't had on offer for the rest people, of the day. People have fifty seven. Eight fifty seven. People have just arrived. They're like, I don't know what's going on. I don't know why I'm here. I don't know what's happening. But rest Thank assured, you your Sunday night just got a thousand times better. Um, thank you for stopping your jerking off session so that you could come and watch Paul Shear eat two slices of bread in under a minute to raise money for charity. You yeah. won't be let down. Also, if you're part of the contingent that are here, yeah. because bitches be horny for Spo, we've got that too. <laughs> yeah. and we're here for episode two of Talking Tea with Zooks and the Boys. Well, we're still talking tea. So please still send in your pictures of you drinking that tea. I just announced, I just announced it on Fuck. my Discord. 
I'm telling people in the Discord who are up right now. I have a hundred people that are on my Discord that are up. That means they can come over here in a second. Yeah. That's what we need. Great. Holy shit. Is there any has there been any fan art for uh bitches be horny for Spo? Let's get I some. Wanna, I wanna I, see it. I have I not see it. I have not gotten any yet so far. Yeah, there was just fan art for you know what? I want to I want bitches be horny for Spo in the pleasure yacht from uh is yeah, it like that. the pleasure yacht? Guys, we're so almost at 900. We're almost at 900. Dryden. People in we're here. talking about we're talking about Dryden Voss. Voss. I want Dryden Voss's pleasure yacht. Yes, I'm talking. We're talking Dryden Voss. We're talking all the great villains. What's that? Well, oh, George is talking from Star Wars. Oh, cool. <laughs> it's a <laughs> it's funny. Nine hundred and twenty-one. We've cracked nine hundred. We're, we're almost there. Okay, we're almost it's incredible. there. You cannot it's incredible. incredible. You cannot have really done it. You're you're heroes. This is happening. What what is this? People are saying things in the chat like, "What is this?" What is show, your best, show your best you right now. Show your best you. You got to tell them what's going on. We got to tell them what's going on. You are at the George guys, Lucas talk show. They are they George are doing. Lucas how long have you guys been streaming for? How many hours? They've yeah. lost their minds. Don't give it to Patrick. Don't give it to Patrick. Watto, tell us what's going on. Give it to Watto. Give it to Watto. 9.43. Watto, go. 16 hours. Oh. You guys have been going for 16 hours. You've yeah. had 90 guests. You've been raising money for Feeding America. You're at, yeah. where are we at on the money? Uh, right right now, uh, 33.016 is where we're at. Let me refresh. 9.43. get 1,000 people in here. If we just need to get about 50 more people in here, if we get 50 more people in here, Jason's going to donate $1,000. Watto is going to donate $1,000 and a penny. And if no, you are you know, all wanting you know. to, you can also donate some money. But when that happens, I am going to eat two slices of bread in under a minute. They say it can't be done. Someone has called into the show multiple times and said it is impossible. Mm -hmm. I am going to see if it is possible. We've been here for over two hours. And I think, oh, it dropped to 936. We just lost <sighs> people. Okay. No. No. Somebody says 1069. Oh, no, no. That's Watto's, that's, that's the Watto's yeah. money. Sorry. We can yeah, do this, people. Get guys, somebody you in, guys here. Get in here. We're we have to hurry up and get these people. people or some of these sleepy people are going to log off. And here's the Don't let them log off. Don't let the cowards log off. Here's the other thing. Don't as soon as we see off. it, as soon as we see the number, it counts. That's what we're yeah, saying. Yeah, absolutely. All I we need to do is get 60 more. Whoever's watching. 941. We're at 941. 941. 941. Yeah. Give us the 59 people. 59 people. That's all we need. 59. Guys, this is a Not referendum on Patrick as a rat. If you think Patrick is a rat, you need to bring 50 of your friends in here to bomb the chat room to say Patrick is a rat. Okay. Mm -hmm. But only if you do that. Only if you do that. Patrick's a rat. All right. All right. Oh, people say that so if we make too much sense, it's going to turn people away. All right. So we're not. Like, George, tell us a message here. George Lucas, you've been doing the show for 16 hours. What <laughs> what can you tell people to get them inspired to get more people in here? Make I'll George eat two carrots. I'll eat two carrots. 974, 974. Come on. Come at? on, you guys. We only need 26 more carrots. people. We only need 26 so more people. So close, everybody. So close to 1,000. George Lucas is going it. to eat two carrots. Holy oh, George shit. Lucas George, Lucas, George Lucas is going to eat two carrots. These are food-based stunts raising okay, money for go. a food-based charity. Do you understand? 985. 985, everyone. 985. 985. 986. We're getting so close. We're getting so close. Also, guys, if you're new and you're watching and you want to donate to Feeding America, bit.ly slash GLTS gives. We will donate there you it. Go. Also, there if you go. out here. Also, if you're new, if you're new. Bitches be horny for Spo. Oh, Bitches be horny for Spo. Do this for Grogu. Do this new? for Grogu. You got this. We're, what so what we're, we're so close. We're so close. I think the next refresh is. Oh, we're there. We did it. We did it. We got it. We did 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 it. Oh, damn. That was Wait, it. George is eating the carrots. Give it to George. Give it to George. Oh. Give it to George eating the carrots. <laughs> yes. 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 All right, so let's get Pat Patrick get those numbers up. Get the get the yep, thousand. Nub. Get, yep, get nub. the two thousand in there. Get yeah. the two thousand plus a penny, so we get in there, so we can see what the total is right now. I believe it's more than that, but let me. Uh, yeah, well, we at least can get those because we yeah. want to show people what's going on here. We put Manzukas. Manzukas is for one thousand. Watto is for one thousand sixty nine. We I are. Just wanna, can you give it to me for a second? 
Yeah. Yeah. I, I just want to say thank you. And I'm proud of you guys. Amazing. We thank you, everybody. Thank the you. number of people watching this stream in like 15 minutes. That's fucking incredible. That is the power of you goddamn nerds out there. All right. <laughs> Job well done. Now go and donate to Feeding America. Give it but back now to George. Have, and no, they're here now for the challenge. They're here for a challenge. Oh, yeah. So yeah, George yeah. is going to eat two carrots, but I am going to eat two pieces of bread in under a minute. Right, that's the deal. That's yeah. the deal. A thousand and thirty. A thousand and thirty. Wow, George, wow. you have to. George, you have to time this, George. Mm. You have to. You have the. <laughs> oh my God! All right, I'll do it. You watch with one hand while you eat the carrot with the other hand. Give George that full screen to the carrot screen. Also, if everybody here right now donates a dollar, that's a thousand dollars. Please donate yeah. one dollar. <laughs> oh God! Please don't choke. Oh my God. All right, that's oh god. Blair, god damn it. Please don't. It's not going to be funny if you choke on air. No. <laughs> You're moving it so much. <laughs> Paul People are saying that I should eat the crust last. Uh, I said I was going to roll it up. That was my thing. I'm going to eat it Taki style. Um, now, can I can't pre roll it, I imagine. I have to eat it the right way. Right? You're okay, here we go. It. Guys, we're losing people. We got to eat this bread. I think we got to eat this here we bread. Go. Okay. I'll say okay, this. We don't want to lose people. Yeah. All right. So wait, am I, if it's going to start on me? Yeah. Maybe when, when Jar Jar's tongue hits the six, five, uh -huh. four, okay. four, three, two, one, go. You got this. You got this, Sheer. You got this. T minus 50 seconds. Minus 40 seconds. Yes, yes. T minus Fuck 40 yes. seconds. This is impressive. <laughs> oh, big bite. Be careful. Be careful, please. Swallow, swallow it. Three, two, <laughs> zero. <laughs> oh, wow. That, I'm nervous. Be careful, please. Wait, who joined us? Wait, yeah, who joined us? That was incredible. Stephen Charleston. That was outstanding. Stephen. I was Steven, blown what? away by what I just, I stepped in here and I was blown away. Steven, what happened? You changed um, your name. Oh boy. I got cut loose. Oh no. You it's lost fine. The sponsorship? Yeah, there's no hard feelings, but it was they said it was I wasn't on brand. Guys, Steven was sponsored by a pickle company. That was a, a oh, new Oh, okay. Yeah. I was gonna, I do in a, the private chat, I was gonna a, ask what this game was. Yeah, no, here's a quick refresher. This is Steven yeah, Charleston. You. He's our good friend. He lives with Rich Sumner, okay? And he loves spicy pickles. Yeah, God. Rich, Summer, Rich, Rich, Summer, Rich Summer met him at a premiere for New Girl in season Got five, it. and now he lives in okay. his house. Oh, so there's a right on right. camera, by the way. Just for a second, I just, um, that yeah. was impossible. That was an impossible task. <laughs> yeah. That was incredible. I did it the wrong looked, way. I did it the wrong way. I could have done it differently, um, but I almost died. It's, I was like, it got a little, it, it all just stopped at the top of my throat there for a second. Oh, that <laughs> was scary. I was it's also scared there. when George was eating the carrots that he, because carrots are real chokeable. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, Wait, but I oh, know, oh. I know the importance of mastication and I wanted to make sure that I masticated on camera for several minutes and didn't rush uh, eating the carrots. So there'd be no choking hazard at all. You will have to okay, be good. responsible with these things. I want right. to try it again. I want to try it again in another time because I feel like I could have a better. I understand now. Abigail wants to chase that dragon, but I get it. I get why. What I other? Do you have done it? I got it all in my mouth. I just couldn't swallow it. Now right. here's the thing. I, I think we may phrase, have been a little. The phrase you should not have said. I think we may have been a little bit lenient in that. What you want? You should have done. 
Put this on me. I'll tell you what? how you eat. That. I'll tell you how you eat that oh, bread boy. fast. Put this on me. Here we go. Put this on me. You got. You got. <laughs> you got. You got to suck those lips first, cause oh, bitches geez. be born. Oh, 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 oh God! Oh, God. Oh. Oh. George, what were you now, trying to say? I was well. I think we may actually, uh, unless I'm mistaken, I think it's fine to wet the mouth down first. But I think Hell once yeah. you're in the challenge, you're not allowed to be drinking during the actual challenge. So it's maybe even harder okay. than you think. Guys, can I uh, say definitely something? harder? I mean, I needed that water a little bit. Uh, although I do believe that that we water, all need water. <laughs> that water created a concrete like uh, thing going on in my oh. throat. Oh god! Like it, it, it actually, it actually felt like. It, like, you were plug, like you were plugging it up yeah it felt like i couldn't get any i was like okay this is funny i can't swallow oh, like, and then as soon as the minute was up i was i needed to get to a place to make sure that that was gonna now this might be me just getting drunk with with money and power at this point but we're so close to getting double our goal for the day which was what again remind me 20 20 20 okay we can do this. We can, right. we, can, we can do this. Well, let's hear now, about Especially this. now that we have the added extra power of Stephen Charleston, shirtless yeah. Stephen Charleston. Because wasn't part of your whole thing, Stephen Charleston, you would go shirtless for a certain amount of money? No, I'm, I'm usually shirtless, Jason. Okay. You probably already know that, but... Of course. I don't really <laughs> get what the... Again, super familiar with the, the, yeah. the specifics. Well, the it's pretty popular. Of this character. Pretty popular. <laughs> So I, I thought, I thought, I'm sorry, I thought Stephen Charleston was part of the uh, legacy universe now. <laughs> no, he's not legends. He's not oh, legends. legends. That's what I meant. Sorry. Now, Stephen, they let you go. They said you were not being brand friendly. Is that true? They didn't. He just said it, I wasn't on brand, and they they said we're cutting you loose. Okay. It's okay. fine. As I'm realizing, they had Dave's killer bread, and that truly almost killed me. Oh. That's uh, stuff, if you add water, it grows. <laughs> but like, I mean, I mean, yes, physically, grow, but I mean, it takes life and sprouts. <laughs> That's that the problem. Is, that was danger. That oh, was that dangerous. dangerous. I'm still getting over it. Um, I will. I am all in for the the larger goal of getting to 40. But I have to. I literally have to do some important work that I've been putting off now for two hours. <laughs> I'll come back. I'll come back to see what's going on. Oh, okay. Wait, how did we lose Wano and George? <laughs> we cut them loose. I think I think Spo is too much, and they were like, "We got to get to a breakout room." Paul, okay. thank you for coming in. You, uh, if you want to come back later and see if we're still here, there's. A I, I'll just keep myself here. Just keep me in the, uh, the yeah, the yeah, outside. Yeah, yeah. yeah, all right, great. We'll see you, Bye, everybody. Great work, great work. That's what that, look at we look at what we did, guys. We really we did something exceptional, right? Well, I got I got a um I got a challenge. Yeah. <laughs> the first person to donate twenty dollars, I'll forward them my my Coles um email I just got. <laughs> okay. You'll forward them an e he'll forward them just a Coles email. Now, yeah. now Shannon, uh, sp bitches be horny for Spo. Yeah. How many times do they get to email you then after that? They can email all they want. Okay. Doesn't mean I'll answer. But for twenty dollars, you can get twenty percent off at Kohl's. Bitches be horny for spell. Okay. Will you forward their emails on as well? Yeah. Oh, when I get their emails, yeah. Yeah, when they email you back. Yeah, I'll forward their emails back to them. Oh, I will say awesome. this. I will say this too. Now that Sheer is gone, mm -hmm. we can have a proper Mando Monday breakdown. Well, uh, if we want to do, I know M Mando Mar Monday starts on the West Coast uh, in about forty minutes. <laughs> it's already Just starting. Another on the East Mando Monday. Well, Ooh. if we if we want to count me into Mando Monday, um, also, I gotta say, I know it's all the fundraiser, but this this for a little while now has not felt like the. Uh, <laughs> it hasn't felt like the show, and it hasn't really felt like the after show either. Yeah. Oh. Interesting. Hmm. You think we're just going to hop right into it, George? Straight to I think, it? I think we did it. I think it happened. Wow. Interesting. Uh, yeah, I could see that being the case. Uh, do you guys all agree with that? I agree. I heartily agree. I, I, I suppose already there. So, I mean, I guess I can, I can go. All right. I was just going to say it.
Does, should I howl too? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I gotta. Shit. <laughs> Alexa! Turn off the lamp! Well, guys, welcome to the George Lucas talk show after dark. And, um, welcome, and welcome to Mando Monday. Welcome to Mando Monday. Now, George, Mando, there, yeah. there are two people in here where we don't know where they stand, if they're okay with hearing about Mando Monday. You should ask. Absolutely. W would you ask for me, Patrick? Sure. Uh, bitches be horny for Spo or Steven, just Steven Charleston. Do either of you care if this week's episode of The Mandalorian gets spoiled? <laughs> No, I've never seen any episodes of it. Yeah, I can't afford Disney Plus with my uh, current employment situation. <laughs> All right. It, um, if you want to. George, hang on. Hang on. Yeah. Okay, George. I could hear you that whole time. No. <laughs> did, did it play? It did. Yeah. I don't see the bumpers. So we're in Mando Monday now? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Hopefully this uh, this will contain enough warning that for those of you who are watching who don't wish to be spoiled for Mandalorian season two finale, because this will completely spoil it for you. <laughs> so you've been warned. Should Baby Yoda be a thing that is 51 years old? He has a name, it is Grogu, and that's what we have been told. It's Mando Monday now, my dear, you buy things from a store. They made a lot of things for you, and they're going to make more. Hey, did you see the episode that ended season two? If you have not watched out, my friends, I must spoil it now for you. The time has come for me to say I'm about to spoil the show. So if you have not seen it yet, it is time for you to go. I'm giving you this warning now, so you will not be glum. When I start singing things about the most recent Mandalorian. Oh no, you say this is not fair. I want to watch your show. But I still have not seen the one that they dropped two days ago. Okay, I say, then how about this turn off for just a bit? Maybe a minute, maybe two. I'm about to spoil that shit. <laughs> okay, here comes a spoiler. They brought back Jedi Luke Skywalker. It was Mark Hamill, yes, with the aid of CGI. Luke showed up and he killed some droids, then took away Grogu. Then after all the credits, Boba Fett, Boba Fett killed this for true. And now we have to wait a year to watch the season three. Thank God for Mando Mondays, which keep on selling things to me. For Mando Monday, yub a yub, it's every seven days. They make the things I buy, the things all because this is the way. Wow. That was incredible. Wow. Wow. I am like 
legitimately moved. So what happened? Uh, Luke Skywalker showed up, killed a bunch of robots, and then he's like, I need your baby. And he takes the baby away. And then meanwhile, Boba Fett, he goes to the club and he's like, hey, you, I want to sit where you sit. And he's like, oh, no, I thought you were dead. He said, no, you're dead now. He shoots him. Well, sits no, down. That, I mean, if that's Bib Fortuna. George, Bib he Fortuna. shoots yeah. Bib Fortuna. Bib Fortuna. Yeah. The, the Star Wars fans, Mike Pence. <laughs> <laughs> and 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 to do, he shoots Bib for tuna because Bib is made of tuna, and That's he's right. like, "Yum, yub nub, I want that tuna." Yub That's nub, right. I want that tuna. Yeah. There's Joe. Show. There's Jason's yeah, catchphrase for his. That's the t-shirt. That's the teacher. Yub nub, I want that tuna. <laughs> and and we have to say, you know, we we like to do a thing on this show, which is we ask viewers to. Uh, Tweet at Mike Pence without tagging, without putting anything in the tweet. No hashtag, no tag. Just tweet pictures of Bib Fortuna at Mike Pence. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because timeline. Yeah, and there is a photo that we prefer. Let me find it. Yeah, there's a photo we prefer. But here's the thing: we always say Mike Pence is Bib Fortuna, and Bib Fortuna got shot the same day that they made Mike Pence take the vaccine. <laughs> 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 Wait, is he dead? We think he's dead. Wh which one? Bib, Bib Fortuna. Fortuna. Oh, Bib Fortuna. oh, yeah. R.I.P. But yeah, R.I.P. Bib Fortuna. This guy. This guy yeah. Right yeah. And he had he had to go. R.I.P. BFD. Yeah. 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 And he's just I'm... this big, pasty, white loser who works for the most disgusting club owner. <laughs> well, now it seems as though he's taken over Jabba's operation. Yeah. Now, Jason, let's ask you this. How do you think he got off that sail barge? Good Fortuna? Yeah. That's a good question. I mean, and certainly some of those people survived, you know? Yeah. You think Max Rebo survived? Of course. Okay. Of course. He's got to bring jizz to the universe. He's got to bring... <laughs> He's got to bring jizz to the fucking. Uh, he's get, he's bringing jizz to wild space. <laughs> Patrick, Patrick, what? Patrick, what? Are you not even going to update the total and see how much money we have raised after all the friends, after two big ticket donations from Zooks and Watto? I think I think I did Watto, but I will update it again. Also, death count should be 91 now. Nah? Uh, we are uh, at. Yeah, Wado, I did this already, but uh, we are at 36,614 and 97 cents. Uh, okay. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. That's pretty good. That's a bit 40. I, now I remember. Now that I'm seeing this, I remember. But we this do this looks here. familiar? <laughs> it looks yeah, familiar. I think it looks familiar. What I'm what I'm wondering is um, hang on hang on Watto did you just say this looks familiar vaguely <laughs> familiar yes <laughs> okay my question to Stephen Charleston is are you now that you've lost your sponsorship are you off of pickles no 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 hard feelings I'm a I'm a pickle fan uh, from early on and uh, you know it, they can't kick me off of that train mm -hmm. you know that saying yeah. 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 They can't kick me off of that train. Can I, like like in the Mandalorian um episode two episodes ago when they mm. when they kicked a lot of people off of that train. <laughs> right. But they, but not me. George George, can I ask, are there pickles in the Star Wars universe? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> what is, George? Is that tape? George <laughs> George, have you been going through the tapes? George, tell him what that is. Somebody was very kind and sent me a copy of uh, a pre McClunky uh, VHS of episode four. So I destroyed it. <laughs> now I wear it. Like There's one less suit. in the world. And Jason, Jason, Chris Eliopoulos came on earlier and drew this. <coughs> oh my God, that's wow. amazing. <laughs> and show the Vieira pick. Show the Vieira pick. Because, because. Jason, this is why I w we always wanted to have you on the live show, but we were never able to make it work. One of the I things we would do it. is we would take old copies of the pre, like the the pre special edition cuts of Star Wars movies, sure. and we would destroy them. And there would always be a fifty. I mean, America is a divided country, so it would always be a 50-50 split. Half the audience would be braying for us to <laughs> tear apart these laser discs and VHS 
half <laughs> and the other half will be it's crying amazing. and weeping and begging us not were to you uh, oh not were you uh george uh, it, uh, i'm not going to ask you that but i remember the weekend that um deathly hallows came out that's meredith um, era destroying a a, a, a pre-final oh, cut that's amazing <laughs> That is incredible. Waddle looks like he's got a huge honker between his legs. Waddle looks like he's off to the side, like jacking it. Honk honk. Look at that honker coming yeah, through. Honker. <laughs> Waddle's, like, Waddle's like straight perving it out there. What is oh, going that? on, here, Waddle? Waddle! Look at that white ass. At least Pee Wee Herman was in an X rated movie theater. Killing it. Bryson. <laughs> Bryson on fire. Just be careful. That tape is very flammable, George. Just be careful. <laughs> what, a what a way to end, though. What a way to end. What a way to end. Going up. I don't have, you don't have any actual candles near you, do you? I got a question no. about Although, after dark rule. Yeah. I have to, I have no to take my laptop with me to the bathroom. Sure. Oh, God. No. What? No. We don't. Nobody wants that. No, we're, we're trying to raise money. Bitches be horny. Unless, oh. if, if we get to if we get to forty thousand dollars, we can watch Spo take a deuce. Spo, the answer's no. Who's saying no? <laughs> hey, Bryson. Bryson. You can't see it, though. You can't see Bryson. it. Bryson. We're in the dark. Oh, make, me, make me full screen, Bryson. We're in the dark. Bryson. Oh, <laughs> Bryson. We're in the dark. Bryson. <laughs> if you're gonna come onto the stream and rhyme like that. Saying something like "spo," the answer is no. You best be coming back with a bumper that says that. <laughs> you can't come on with a rhyme like that and not make a bumper. George, I hate to tell you, it's life day. It's a holiday. The bumper factory's closed. But I know that's why I'm saying you don't come on and be like a rhyming little bitch coming on and teasing us with those bumpers that are just made to be bumped. But I'm I'll say this, Bryson. I Bryson, it's life day, and I think sometimes the rules don't apply on life day. <laughs> I just <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Come on. Uh, good. This is good. <laughs> I think I came back just in time. You did. You got the right time. Uh, okay, so Bryce, can you get to work on that for us? The spo, it's a no? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Bryson. Thank you, Bryson. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. I didn't bring out Bryson to his proper uh, bumper. Hang on. Hey, Bryson, you're going to go make that? Uh, yeah, before I go, can I show a bumper? All right. Yeah. Oh, yeah, sure. What is it? Oh, wow. Well, I got you guys something for Life Day. Whoa. It's, it's, it's an evergreen bumper that I figured you guys could get a lot of use out of. Sure, let's see it, Bryson. Let's Patrick Connor finally living his lifelong dream of being on camera. Yes. <laughs> Doesn't like being on camera. Doesn't like being on camera. <laughs> wow. Now, look at him now. Look at him now. The kid, loves it. Liar. the kid loves it now. The kid. Now that now that now that the kid now that the kid's the rat, he loves that camera. <laughs> Patrick, you can camera. do the thing to me now. Okay. Hey Bryson, you're gonna go make that bumper? Yeah. Bye bye, Bryson. Hey, Steven. Yeah. Earlier on the show, you were drinking a lot of pickle juice. I was. You got any more? I mean, Justin Chew, I believe in you. Justin Chew. He's got nothing to lose. <laughs> I will say that I have had a lot of milk <laughs> oh, since God. we were last together <laughs> and some ice cream. Well, because <laughs> a lot of pickle juice is an acid. There's a vinegar. Oh, God. And so I was trying to get alkalines in my system to, to save some of my stomach lining. 
Oh, God. do you have any like apple cider vinegar? What would that do? Um, I don't know. Probably make Wouldn't it worse. Make it worse. <laughs> yeah. Do, do you have any like batteries you can chew into? Why are you giving me all the stuff that's going to make it? That's terrible. I did this stuff that was good. The milk and the ice cream. <laughs> but now you're going to have diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> Believe me. I, listen, I, at your age, dairy is not your friend, Stephen Charleston. <laughs> I am aware of this. It's been a very bad day. Uh-huh. <laughs> I do... I do want to bring up a tweet that's been brought to my attention. Tomorrow, you guys are all going to get a text from Stephen Charleston saying, that was not worth it. I feel awful. <laughs> Here's the text that, or a tweet that I was uh, was brought to my attention. Nice. Spo. Okay, the bitches do be a little. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm down. Yo, I also got, I got um, guest number 91. <clears throat> oh, what? yeah. <laughs> Let's I mean, I, I, I mean, I would. Can we get? The, I mean, I, I, I'm, I want to steal some of this thunder. I want bitches be horny for Zooks. <laughs> I want to be I, in this. I'm sure thought. we could search on Twitter for I that. I want in on that. I want in on that catchphrase. But <laughs> all right, guys, if anyone out there wants to tweet hashtag bitches be horny for Zooks, we'll show them on the air. And it doesn't you know have what? to be a hashtag. And you know what? Men, let's men let's always are taking women's fucking. It's true. I, it's true. I'm stealing Spose things. So you know what? Get rid of it. Spose, okay. Never mind. Spose, 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 crush, get rid of it. Get rid of it. If you, if you I, tweet that, it will never be on the show. Nope. <laughs> if you tweeted it, here's here's my new catchphrase. If you tweeted it, you better deleted it. <laughs> oh, Bumper. 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 How about cunts be wet for Zooks? Oh, God. Oh, God. That I got know. racy. Oh, no. Wow. That's it's really called a bluff. That is a, some good bluff calling. Yeah. Let's see how many how many tweets we get for that one. <laughs> Manzuka <laughs> retreated and Spo immediately attacked. It, <laughs> it's it's so true. Cool. She sensed weakness. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone, get your burner accounts ready to tweet from. Yeah. What for Zooks? Man, Zookas, I I want to uh, thank you for your advice. I do think it was a bad idea to combine this porn up videotape with these Christmas lights. Yeah, be careful. Uh, I'm now untangling them, which I think is might be the rest of my life's work. Yeah. <laughs> now, Spo, I believe this is a mixtape cover for you. Oh yeah, I just. Wow. Oh yeah. Yeah. Um, oh no. boy. And I want to remind people uh, that it, I don't want to leave Steven out of this. So I, you got to tweet at Sucker Punch Pick. Hashtag I want to Steven my pickles because we want the brand Sucker Punch Pickles to make some Steven Charleston branded pickles. Put, oh, the, wow. put my face here. Even though uh, even though they, they've cut me loose. Yeah. I still think that, how do you, that, that uh, this yeah. Could be me. Because that would then then I would literally be on brand. And yeah. we don't have to we don't have to go through this again. <laughs> hopefully this is hopefully this is the last time we see Steven before we have pickles for him. I agree. Hey, Patrick, yeah, water. Check the private chat. Sure. Oh, oh that's good. pretty good. Yeah. Check your DMs, Patrick. Oh wow! Oh boy! Private chat. Oh no! I see it! I see it! Here we go. What's happening? Oh, I I. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what do you see? Wow! Oh, at like crafty it. freakout. At crafty <laughs> freakout. I like it. Now I'm on board. Now I'm, now I'm on board. <laughs> yeah, seeing it in print really kind of softens the blow. Now I'm like. <laughs> You know That's what? That does look one. good. That does. That does. There is a certain a certain elegance to it. <laughs> it's kind of cute now. Now it's kind of charming. That's yeah, adorable. That cuss. Oh wait! Oh, oh boy, guys! There's wet. another. Uh, there's a big update. You know who else is tweeting about this? Are we trending? Your mom. Oh, so. <laughs> <laughs> the defunct streaming service. 
<laughs> they saw it, so they The real it. question is, who still has that login? Now, now, Jason, I believe, I believe CISO let it lapse, and then someone hopped on it. Ah, uh, okay, okay, okay. I believe that is what happened. They, they also made sure to make it look exactly like it always did, so that we'd <laughs> yeah. forever be confused. That's <laughs> <laughs> <It's> really <laughs> funny. That's so funny. That's very funny. That's been retweeted. And, and they have 72 followers, which is more than I think CISO had uh, when they were running the account. So. Wow. I work, like I work, that dead horse down. Just I work there. I work there. It's fine. <laughs> Wait, you work there? Is that why they went out of biz? Yeah, that was yeah. one of the reasons. It, you you didn't didn't want to here's the thing. Guys, here's the thing. Let's, let's go through them. CISO. The Chris Gethard Show. R.I.P. The President Show. R.I.P. What do all these things have in common? You. A rat. A rat. And then oh. they're gone. You can't search for cunts be wet for Zooks. Really? Because of language, you mean? Yeah. It has to, it has to, it has to it search a hashtag. You. It's a hashtag. Oh, wow. Here's a here's a good tweet. Um to UCB Theater in New York. Yes, that's another thing that, that Patrick touched. That, that is true. <laughs> uh, this is hashtag. Daniel Stonebreaker says, we named our dog Zook, so obviously, hashtag. What? Is Zooks. that real? That's amazing. Yeah. We, named, we named the dog Zooks. <laughs> R.I.P. R.I.P. It was in the dark, but uh, R.I.P. <laughs> thank you, George. <laughs> Oh boy! Aren't you allergic to dogs, Zooks? No, I'm allergic to like some dogs. Uh, like I could, I, I'm a uh, like long-haired dogs are no good, but I can do like a short-haired dog. Like egg dogs? I can't have an egg dog, Watto. No, because <laughs> I'm allergic to eggs. I talk I about it on all the podcasts. This I learned it on nailed it. Clarify. Where did you learn that, Stephen? I nailed it. <laughs> <laughs> are you a big fan of nailed it? My children watch it Whoa. fucking all day. Whoa! Whoa! I, wait! 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 Not my children. They're like <laughs> my children. Whose children are they, Stephen? They're riches, but they're like mine. We've become very close. Oh, no. oh, this is really weird, man. This sounds weird. <laughs> Because you also like it seemed as though they were in the same house that you're in without a shirt Shut on. Up. Yeah. Shut up. Yeah. Yeah. Now the crit. Hey, Stephen. Stephen. Yeah. Is Rich still awake? Because he sent a video earlier saying he couldn't stop by. I mean, I can check. Can you go check? Yeah. Give me a sec. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, I. I hope he's awake. I don't know. Oh wow. <laughs> What's he doing back? A naked person. This is the content that people want at this hour. Here we are, still raising money. Where are we numbers wise? <laughs> uh, let me do a refresh. Oh, I believe. Oh, oh wow, look at this. Wait, Rich. George, we got to meet you really quick. Uh, Steven gave me these sunglasses to to, <laughs> to put on. Yeah. <laughs> They're prescription, <clears throat> so I don't know how he was seeing, but now I can see. Well, that's good. Um, What's happening? Good. I was I was just about to head to bed. Sure. Buddy, Rich, it's great to see. It's Jason Manzoukis. Oh, what's up, Jason? Hey, is that uh, in Spo there? Hey, what's yeah. happening? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Watto, Watto. Rich isn't on the show yet. Rich. Ooh, new guest. Yeah. It's Wolfman Watto. Oh, what's oh, happening? Oh, oh. I got some bad news for you, Rich. What's that? Technically, you're not on the show yet. Oh, it feels like I'm this on the show. Live. Everyone can see and hear you, okay. but it's not canon because you haven't been introduced yet. Oh. Do, do you How would to... you like? I would love. How would you like to be introduced? Um, <clears throat> I guess, um, you know, um, you could, you could say, uh, uh, loving father and 
uh, fan of fun, Rich Summer. Oh. All right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Love Love fun, fun, it gives me great pleasure to introduce our next guest. He's a loving father. And what was the second part? Friend of fun. Fan, er, of, fun. fan of fun. Fan of fun. This next guest, he's a loving father and a friend of fun. Hashtag cunts be wet for zoops. Rich <laughs> summer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, I didn't sign up for the hashtag, but but thanks. I'm glad to be here. It's a movement. You can't stop it at this point. That it's was it from moment. before you were on, Rich. Oh, Sorry. there was like a great a bit or something, like a great bit. There was a bit. There was a bit uh, earlier, yes. That's fun. <laughs> I'm oh, sorry wow. you got bent into it. Hang on. Well, yeah, I, was... I actually, I just got something sent to me. I'm going to bring it up. It's another tweet. I love tweets. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow. That is huge. Yeah, now, that's not oh, from his man. VP. That's not from his VP account. That's from his account. I mean, RIP Bib Fortuna. It's his wow. personal that, account. That vaccine took quick. The guy oh, yeah. they watch now is asking, "Is that real?" <laughs> yes. Yep. Hey, who's saying this? They, they, they watch every, now. Everything is real. Everything is real. Everything huh. is real. Well, Rich, I mean, it was good seeing you. Thank you for stopping by. Thanks for having me, guys. You could probably go. Oh, thanks for the video earlier, Rich. Yeah. Oh yeah, absolutely. I'm sorry I couldn't be here earlier, but you know we were just trying to trying to hang out with the fam a little bit today. So that's yeah. totally, <laughs> totally understandable, totally. Rich. If you got to go back to bed, that's totally fine. But can you grab Stephen again for us? Yeah, we got. Oh, and, oh, can, we get, can we get Rich saying McClunky? Oh yeah, Rich, say McClunky. Oh sure. Oh look at that Inception thing going on there. Uh, McClunky. Right. Yeah, it looks great. Look, you have a rich summer in your in your reflection. Mm -hmm. Also, know that Stephen thinks your kids are his kids. Oh yeah, yeah. He literally, she has, rich, rich, we've had Stephen this referred to him as my kids. I we know. said my I know. kids. What has the conversation been like? You've had this before. It's uh, it's becoming it's becoming like close to a breaking point. That oh, no. that exact thing. And I imagine did he did he seem to have any sort of. Um, Awareness of the fact that he had said it. Uh, no, perhaps a response once to we, it. After, once we reacted, he started to panic. He yeah, panicked. yeah, panic sounds right because I said if he keeps saying that, I he can't stay here anymore. So he uh, also was like aggressively not wearing a shirt. Mm -hmm. Well, that he never wears a shirt. Really, the only time I've seen yeah. him wear a shirt is when he was sponsored earlier today. Yeah, yeah, right. Huh. I'm glad you were watching. I thought you were busy. <laughs> no, he showed me a, a. We passed in the yard, and he showed me a, a right. screen. Why are you guys? Up, yeah. You guys are both outside. Just, well, he lives here. We're in my yard. It's okay. We're not. We don't. In our yard, I can be around right. people who live, whom I live. Okay, Rich, can you go get Stephen again? We got to talk to him. Yeah. Uh, well, great seeing you guys. Thanks, yeah. Rich. Take care, Rich. Great to see you. Great to see you, Jason Shannon. Good to. I'll yeah, see you guys congrats, later. Congrats on that Herald team. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 Rich, Rich, yeah, Rich, come back. Quick, quick question: yeah. Yeah. What was the first? What was the first Herald team you were on? Uh, first, there was only the one. <laughs> Which one? Let's hear about it. Yeah. I think I've told this story already. Yeah, no, you have. We want to hear it again. Because <laughs> I love, I do, lo I love telling it. It was called America. Okay, yeah, and we um we lasted for three Heralds. Oh, yeah, only which three. Been, I believe yeah, confirmed an inauspicious as, debut <laughs> as the shortest lived Herald team of all time. Huh. And, and five of our members, uh, five of our eight members went on to other Herald teams when we were cut. And three other members, um, of which I'm, I'm included, yeah. we, that was it. Huh. Rich, Rich, before you can leave, you, I, can I ask you how you felt after you got cut? Uh, like, were you were you a happy man? I'm going to answer this entirely honestly. Okay. I felt a mixture of things. I felt uh, uh, embarrassed. Yeah. Because that's that was a short <clears throat> run. Yeah. Yeah. But I also uh, went. I get it. Mm -hmm. I I absolutely get it. So it was a um, it's something I've never uh, felt compelled to argue against because. 
I was there for those three heralds and mm -hmm. I contributed very little of yeah. uh, <laughs> substance. Yeah. Can I ask a follow-up question? Rich? Yeah, absolutely. Thanks. Do you, do you feel as though <clears throat> the dissolution of the Herald Team America mm. presaged the dissolution <laughs> of the country America? <clears throat> uh, I think it's do you safe. Think, <clears throat> do you think that the Herald Team was a canary in a coal mine for the mm -hmm. country? Mm -hmm. you know, uh, I, as I, goes America, the Herald Team, so goes the country. Well, yeah. it's funny because at the week we were cut, and again, I've told this story on the show, but we were cut on Tuesday, and on Thursday we had our first cage match, and uh, <laughs> we we won nine weeks in a row. But nice. it was it was by bribing the audience with a of case course. of beer every week. Yeah. Classic. And all of this fits perfectly into what has happened uh, to yeah. America. So, so you yes, guys were, you guys yeah. were you guys were stealing the election. By That's providing correct. beers, you were buying votes. Hundred yeah. percent. So wait, Rich, you still didn't answer my question. Did you feel like were you like a happy man when you got cut? Oh boy. Uh, I guess happy didn't. Uh, no, that wasn't one of the emotions I felt. Was there another like a like an angry? Uh, Patrick's obviously trying to shoehorn something in. And yeah, what are we really going weird. for here? Were you um, trying to force a bit? Uh, no. Okay. Were, you like, were you angry? Were you angry? Were you an angry yeah. man? Uh, no. No, but but do you want me to say yes? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was angry. What what else? How would you else would you say that? Oh my I god, can, that's <laughs> not the thing you want to be angry, but I, that wasn't the destination. No. Patrick, Patrick, <laughs> you would have fit perfectly on the Herald Team America. Rich, this yes. is how we did scenes. <laughs> Rich, Rich, yeah. Rich, were you were you a madman? Oh, uh, I gotta go. I'll go get Steve. Ooh. 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 Patrick, Ooh. Patrick, Ooh. Patrick, you know what? You know what, Jason? You know what, Jason? I live that's, off of this. I live right. off of it. Patrick, that's why I every place you were right. failed. That's why what? Every place you were failed. <laughs> oh, good luck, Marvel. Yeah. From How, how's the money? Right. How's the money? Let's see. Um. Look how evocative. Uh, oh, uh, my the, God. The, 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 the <laughs> oh, boy. We're still at 31, 30. We're still at 36, 614 is where we were at. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah. Pretty good. Um, oh, oh, wow. He's back. Oh, wow. Hey, hey Steven. Steve hey, Charlton. He came running in like a like a wolf man. Like a wolf man. I said earlier that they had never seen me run, so I wanted to try it again. It's true. Yeah, I saw it. <laughs> it's, it's, it's true. <laughs> Thanks for asking, Kendall. I'm fine. <laughs> and, <laughs> and a terse interaction with Rich. Why? What I'm happened? Waiting. Well. Wait, do you think he was, was he not happy when you saw him? I might have kind of, I kind of fucked up a little bit. You guys know, I, just, I said, said the thing about the kids. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and that doesn't, it's usually a thing in that house today. And so it was, it led to a little moment. Yeah. We'll say. Right. He was upset with you? He's he's always he's always upset. He's, an, he's I, angry. He's angry. I, I would say, I would say he's a, he's a mad man. Oh wow! <laughs> that was, that's an organic joke, Stephen that Charles. Was well done. Well done. That was a nice casual Eff walk to that joke. Effortless, organic, and a light touch. Patrick, <laughs> take note. Like a feather. Like a feather touch. Yeah, the guy, the guy's a pro. The guy's a goddamn pro. White glove service on that show. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to whomever said that's actually really funny, Stephen. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Good, good. good. I hope you've learned a lesson here today. Patrick, Patrick. check your DMs. <laughs> Why? Patrick, check your DMs. Patrick, check your DMs. And check your check your goddamn DMs. Unless unless you don't want to check your DMs, Patrick, in which you in which case, Patrick, you need to say 
I don't, I, got to I, don't know, know. I don't know if this is it, but could this be what was in my DMs? <laughs> <laughs> what? That? I don't know. That's crazy. The, they took my <laughs> face. <laughs> 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 that, is some, that is some excellent face swapping. Oh boy. <laughs> Wait, but but bitches behind me for Spo, is that what you wanted him to find? I don't know what I wanted him to find. I just saw someone uh, said check your DMs. I imagine that was probably it. That was from had uh, two, yeah. two things in it. That was from Matthew Weinstein. That was who that was from. You just had one? Matt Weiner, creator of Mad Men? That was... <laughs> it was Matt Weiner. <laughs> right in into my DMs. Rich, Rich, when he left, did say he was going to send out the, the, the... He was going to text blast the, the Mad Men group and get them on board. Yeah. He did? <laughs> yeah. He definitely yeah. said that. We all heard it, and it's binding. Yeah. He said, yeah. They're, still, he said they're still on the text chain, and they talk every day. Yeah. Mm. He said, wow. "Those guys would. Those guys would love what you guys are up to." Well, I'm sure they're all going to be here any second. Then <laughs> you're missing one, Patrick. What are you talking about, guys? Look at that. You're missing. Check your DMs again. Oh, okay. I'll check your BMs. Here it is. Why do people DM me stuff? Just tweet it at me, and I'll see it. Oh, look at that! Wow. I love that. Look, that's my record, guys. Yeah. Remember when I put out my, my record of the Nelson Riddle arrangements? <laughs> <laughs> remember when I was remember when I went by the moniker Little Zooks? <laughs> what if this just turned into like a great pumpkin Charlie Brown type scenario where we just waited for the Mad Men gang to show up? <laughs> <laughs> Steven says they it's will a, be here. It has yeah. to be a full cast reunion. Oh man, we wait. <laughs> and we wouldn't the... leave. We need the first set. Guest from earlier in the show, Randy Havens, says, How are you all still doing this? <laughs> Randy was here right. about 12 hours ago, I think. We are about to hit 18 hours. <laughs> um, it's, hey, I want to play a little oh, something of Steven. Wait. George, we should get the reunited apart of Mad Men on the George Lucas talk show. Yeah, that's that's a right great now. idea. <laughs> that's a great idea. All right, oh, George, yeah. George, what do you got to play for Steven? I want to play a little blast from the past for Steven. Do you want to explain what it is? What? Do you want to explain what it is? No. Okay. I'll just say a word and then you say it, okay? <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is beautiful. It's not I'm way to of you just where one looking. It's not I'm way to take your hand. I'm not sure. It's not I'm way to let you see what's going on inside of me when it's all of you. We leaving not free. Well, this is when we started doing whole lines. <laughs> I'm easy. Give the word and I'll play your game. So that's what it ought to be. Because I'm easy. Don't leave me on if there's no one oh to me. George, we got it, George. Oh, are we running out of time? Oh, I'm sorry. Are we running long? We got are we running long? Patrick. Happy Mando Monday, West Coast. Patrick. Happy Mando Patrick. Monday, West Coast. Happy oh. Mando Monday, West Coast. Thank you so much. As, a, as the West Coast rep on this call, I'm thanking you guys. Happy Steven's Mando West Monday. Coast, too. Oh, nice. Sorry. I'm sorry, Steven. I'm West Coast, too.
George, do you have a new song to sing for the West Coast? Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. It's Mando Monday on the West Coast. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. It's Mando Monday on the West Coast. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. It's Mando Monday on the West Coast. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. It's Mando Monday on the West Coast. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. It's Mando Monday on the West Coast. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. It's Mando Monday on the West Coast. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. It's Mando Monday on the West Coast. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. It's Mando Monday on the West Coast. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. Mando, Mando, Mando. It's Mando Monday on the West Coast. Mando, Mando, Mando. George. 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 I was dancing. I was dancing too much. I spilled candle wax on my hand. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Watto? Watto's oh. coming. Wow. wow. Um, I mean, George. You know, am I allowed to? Am I allowed to fuck on this thing? No. <laughs> it's a nil. Oh, that's great. <laughs> Bumper. The life a miracle. So I did miracle. <laughs> George, we're so close to twenty-four hours at this point that I feel like maybe we just keep going. <laughs> uh, we're still a ways away from 24 hours. You're a full work day away. You've rounded the horn, though. You're on your way back. I yeah, mean, yeah. This is the horny for Spo. At this point, a work day is nothing. Yeah. I, and cats, uh, cunts be wet for zooks. I mean, like, these people are up and ready to go. <laughs> so, mm. 500 people watching. This is insane. <laughs> yeah. Um. Oh, that's so funny. Uh, when did I come on? Am I approaching an Irishman? Now we're at we're at two fifty six. <laughs> I would say you came on probably two forty ago. But then you were gone for a long chunk. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Okay, I would say you're coming up on like two. Okay. Yeah. It was just barely a good fellas. Barely yeah, that's good yeah, that's no good. I'm not I'm not gonna last an Irishman. Yeah, I, I mean, I really, as, yeah, yeah. No, I want to know what you really. I, I don't have. I don't think I have it in me. I'm fading. <laughs> I came. I, I came in real hot for a, a while. So yeah. hot, so quick. No one can. No one can say you didn't bring it. I, I guys, I brought it. I brought. I doubled the. I doubled the number of people who were on this thing. I've committed a thousand and one dollars. Yeah. Oh. So we'll we'll see you next week too, right? <laughs> Wait, are you doing this again? <laughs> This is every week until we solve hunger. Wow. Oh. That feels ambitious. <laughs> Same amount of guests. Same amount of guests. We're getting Bruce Valanche back every week until we do it. Okay. Slattery, Slattery is in the chat. Where? What? John Slattery. I'm just kidding. Oh, my God. <laughs> Slattery <laughs> in the chat it, says, "I'm here. What do you need me to do?" It, it would be that would be the thing that would get us to 24 hours is, is if between <laughs> between 3 a.m. East Coast and, and 10 a.m. we gradually assembled the cast of Mad Men for for a reunion that no one planned, no one predicted, yeah. and later no one will believe. Really, Josh Gad is not a part of it. Hey guys, no. I do want to bring up a tweet that just got uh, retweeted onto my timeline. All right. Is it in your DMs? No. Yeah, check your DMs, Patrick. Look at this. Whoa. What is hey. it? Hey. Hey. It doesn't, it doesn't say cunts. Oh, does that say Ryan Johnson? Yeah, where's the hashtag, Ryan? <laughs> Come the on, hashtag, Ryan. Ryan. Ryan Johnson, great work. My favorite of the modern trilogy, Ryan Johnson. I like that Cotner showed us that he liked it before he closed out of it. I didn't, I didn't mean to. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, of course I'm going to like it.
Yeah, um, you had to show us that you liked it. Patrick, yeah. could you shave a little more of your head? I would love to. Here's what I'll say. Here's my here's I'm gonna throw down the gauntlet. Ryan Johnson, pick <laughs> up your banjo, call into the show. Yeah. Kaboom. You know it's also, there. Get on the show playing banjo, Ryan Johnson. Bring it. Did, Patrick, when was that tweeted? That was one minute ago. One minute ago. All right. So we are probably one getting, we were probably getting a lot of first time viewers. Welcome to the show. Last Jedi fans, fans of Knives Out and Looper and the Brothers Bloom and Brick. Um, perfect time to come in. <laughs> this, is, this is a perfect a entry year. point. If you haven't watched the show before, I'm retired filmmaker yeah. George Lucas. This is a great show. Uh, to, to, just uh, right next to me here is great guy, Patrick Cotnar. Uh, Welcome. This is Watto on the other side of me holding. Is that a drum? Is that a percussive log? Excuse me. You should recognize George. Oh, yeah. I recognize it. Oh, it's dark and it's late and I'm exhausted. It's an Ewok drum. Yeah, of course. Uh, I love <laughs> yeah. Wow, oh, Watto uh, found the clit. You know, that's really good, Watto. <laughs> <laughs> me and Watto, have me and Watto. I got a little Ewok dancing to his drum beat. Steven, Steven, while they're doing this, what do you want me to say? I won't do the beard, I'll do anything else. Just the, the grayer side. Oh, just the grayer side? Is that, yeah. is that the side? Just that side, yeah. What's up with these random towels just hanging from the ceiling? Yeah, this seems like a lot of loose, unmatching. No, you're on my, it's on my like towel rack. Don't it be so defensive. Just question. shave What's your that? hair. What's Open the window other? and scream while you do it. You have to scream while you do it. I have a roommate. I'm not gonna do that. Whisper and whisper out the window. Yeah, whisper. I love this out the window. Whisper, oh, this out the window. What's your, what's your, whatever your roommate's name is, scream. This is for you. That person's name. I just remembered that you guys made me put hair gel into my hair earlier. And yeah, trying, to my, trying to shave my hair with hair gel is not comfortable. I think just shave off your mustache. No, no. Okay. <laughs> I like Remember, you if you are just tuning in because Ryan Johnson tweeted about this and you linked to that tweet and are now watching this show, we are raising money for Feeding America. <laughs> this is the George Lucas talk show. Retired Producer, filmmaker George Lucas. Retired filmmaker George Lucas. Watto, uh, 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 not very good producer Patrick, is shaving his head at the request of Wolfman Stephen Charleston. I don't know this why I had to explain all that. This was all this evident. This is me horny for Spo. We, we have sent out, we've thrown down the gauntlet. Ryan Johnson, come on with your banjo. Prove it. Bring it. If you want, there's a link down here. You can donate money. We're going to make Patrick look as ridiculous as he can, and he's going to have to spend the next two weeks looking like this. The George Lucas Talk Show, recommended by the New York Times. <laughs> Flash back to just a head shaving itself. <laughs> Are you kneeling well, in the tub? Make sure, by the way, Patrick, make sure no. you're checking to see if Ryan is trying to get in the in the chat. Don't leave him in the green. Oh my God! <laughs> you don't have the link. We'll give it to him. He, he might slide into your DMs to say, "Hey, if give he me the link." My, if he slides into my DMs, I will send it to him. That's what I'm saying, Patrick. God, Patrick, don't talk back. What are you doing? You need to shave okay. your head and watch the DMs concurrently. Listen, folks, we have to show a little bit of compassion for Patrick. He's a terrible <laughs> producer, but he has a very difficult task at this moment to shave the one side of his head. And I think we need to do what we can to calm him down and put him at ease. And that's okay. why, Patrick, okay. I want to offer you some support. Patrick! I'd like to wail some jizz for you.
Not believe that Ryan Johnson just tweeted about the show, and this is what we're doing immediately I know. afterwards. <laughs> people are people are clicking on that link and are confounded. Patrick. That Patrick, was amazing. Patrick, you look like what people think will happen to them if they take the vaccine. <laughs> <laughs> I aspirated pickle juice when you said that. <laughs> <laughs> now you're going to have to pour milk up your nose. We want to make it clear. Pickles, huh? We want to make it clear to people who uh, thank you for stopping by. If you were directed here by Ryan Johnson's tweet, we want to be clear that this show began at 10 a.m. Eastern time on Sunday morning and with no break. And this um, is the best it's been since. Yeah. And it's <laughs> never been better. The show has right. never been better. Did we get a bump? Right Did we get a bump? Morning. Did we get the Johnson bump? What are we oh, at we, now? We, we're, right. we're dropping. Are we dropping? <laughs> we're at 487. Oh, interesting. But we did go up um, to like 420 while Connor was not on camera. Hang on. Can I say, I did get a, we did get a $150 donation and the, the um, note section says compensation for the marathon you just ran for the Mad Men bit. So, <laughs> so, so nice. it, it pays, it pays to so, do bits. So you're happy about that? Yeah. Yeah, I'm a little happy about it. Yeah, I made a we made $150. You know what? I'll say it. I made $150 for the show. Wait wow. a second. I have some terrible news. Oh, no. Oh, what do we got? Oh, oh, no. no. Terry Crews is trending. <laughs> okay. You got Crews news? What do you got? You got Crews news? Okay, ready. Is I'm there a bumper for that? Right. So wait, 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 wait. My Brighton. blue friend, my blue friend, can you give us some clues? No, first? don't read it. Don't read it, Watto. It's not good. It's not good? No. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. This is bad. 
bad, bad, bad news. I'm not going to. Oh, yeah. It. Don't read that one. I have some it. good news. I have some good news. Okay, good news. Let's get the good news. You can call me John Krasinski because I have some good news. <laughs> Attack of the Clones is trending on Twitter. That's the best news I've heard all day. Okay. We did it. We did it. You guys, we did it. Was that the goal of this? That was the that was the stealth goal, is to get episode two trending, and we did it. Wow! 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 Finally, Tones is back in the zeitgeist. Thank you, Otto. <laughs> Thank you so much. The Terry Crews news is just someone being a dick. I don't understand it actually. Wait, I, really? Yeah, I don't understand it. Someone let's made leave, a let's, fake let's walk away from it. Yeah, yeah don't, not, we're walking let's not away. talk about it. Yeah, it's just someone. It's just like fake news stuff that we don't need to. Oh, don't, yeah, don't, right. don't worry yeah. about it. Yeah, it's not but, anything. But this is real news that wrestler Cody Rhodes <laughs> has inspired fans to do their own ranking of Star Wars movies. And for whatever reason, Attack of the Clones is now the only one that's ranked. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Cody wow. Rhodes had it number nine out of 14 on his list. <laughs> and yet somehow that is the one that is trending. <laughs> you read you you heard about Martin Screlly though, right? No, what happened? He has a friend. Yes, a woman by the name of Christy Smith who covered his uh crime while she was at Bloomberg News. She quit Bloomberg, got a divorce. And froze her eggs to have babies with Martin Screlly. <laughs> She's waiting Which, for him to get but, out of prison. But 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 yeah. if I'm not mistaken, <laughs> she did did a whole interview about this for Elle magazine. And, and Martin's people from prison said, "We wish her the best in her endeavors." <laughs> so she got dumped <laughs> via Elle magazine <laughs> by Martin Screlly. But she Can won't I admit say it. She won't admit it when people ask her on Twitter. She just says, well, Martin would say we don't have a relationship, but he's just mad at me. Whoa. Wow. Uh -oh. That's an uh-oh. Wow. Those are uh-oh words. It's a pretty funny. Patrick, make, make me full screen. Yes, yeah, sure, Lana. I want to formally accuse <laughs> Martin Screlly of starting the not funny Terry Crews thing. <laughs> 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 wait, wait, is he in prison? Yeah. 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 Terry okay. Cruz? No. No, no not Terry. Um oh. um guys, I'm 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 going to call it. I'm out. Okay. All I'm right. wrapping it here. I'm wrapping wow. what, a, what an Why, you give up you give up easy, huh, man, Zugas? I, well, you know, I'll have you remember I was here for five hours one week ago. Oh, my God. You're still coasting on that? That was a week ago, Jason. <laughs> when the God. I was here for up, five hours. Yes, going. Jason, I've I've seen – I've probably talked to you more time in the last week than I've talked to my parents this entire pandemic. <laughs> well, I am your father now. Oh, no. Oh, boy. And Rich's um, kids are our kids. Oh, no. Oh, Jason. <laughs> I like how I like how you I like how you sort of mashed up uh, Empire Strikes Back with Captain Phillips for that line. I am your father Captain. now. Look at me, uh, look at me. I am your father now. I am your father now. It's yeah. a great match. Patrick, I am your father now. Um, this has oh. been an absolute delight, guys. Please, if you're out there, please keep giving. This is for a great cause. You guys are doing incredible work. This has been an amazing time. I've already said my McClunky. It was clean. Let's not worry about it. Mandalorian ended last night. I was in tears. Mm -hmm. Protect Grogu. It's good stuff. I love you all. I love you too. Jason. George. How excited would you be if in season three, uh, Jar Jar is the one that Mando has to protect all season? I wouldn't want that. That's not what I want. And he forms the exact same bond with him. We start to realize that Mando is just he can Mando's he, just me. He's just lonely. He's just eager to, he's, to bond he's with like, whoever. I'll, I'll take my mask off immediately. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'd love it. Uh if you don't mind, Bryson, will you play my bumper one more time? <laughs> Thank
Thanks, guys. Take me out. Take me out. Wow. Wow. We stand a king, Jason Manzukas. We stand a king, Jason Manzukas. Patrick, let's get the updated total. Where are we at in terms of money? Let me let me double check. I think yeah, we got. I think we should follow Jason's leads. <laughs> Have we hit a, a decrescendo? I I'm think gonna, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna go check my I'm gonna go check and see who slid in my DMs. And I'm gonna slide into their labia. Oh. <laughs> right. Well, it's a nil. Wait, wait, we can do one last, let's do one last stretch goal because, okay, because we are at 36, 9, 78, 65. Patrick, I think I have just a stretch goal. Yeah. I've been sitting on something for this very moment. Okay. Is it your own dick? Because that's just huge in that photo we saw. We're so close, Lada. Okay. Let me go get something. I didn't think I was going to share, this, but it feels like desperate times come. Desperate. Okay, we are okay. Let me bring it up. Thirty-six nine seventy-eight seventy-five. Oh, come on. All right, so we just need a 20, 27, 25? No, 20, 20, 26, 25? We need three thousand twelve dollars. Twenty-six twenty-five. <laughs> okay, one of you, one of you people who uh, uh, just got here. <laughs> one of you people who just got waiting, here. If you've been waiting, now's the time. Twenty, twenty, twenty-six dollars twenty-five cents. And if you, you know, I got something for you. Wait, why are you saying twenty-six dollars, George? Isn't that right? What do we got? <laughs> oh, it's left twenty-two dollars and twenty-five cents. No, twenty-one dollars and twenty-five cents, George. Oh, you just right. want to get to thirty-seven thousand? Yeah, I want a nice. Oh, I clean you want to get to forty thousand. I want a nice clean number. No, no. no I want. I want thirty-seven. Number. Nice and clean. No. We'll 40, be here long. Forty's too much. Forty's too much. Forty's too much. We don't want it. We want. Well, we always wanted it to be thirty-seven. We never 21, wanted it to be forty. Yeah. Twenty-one twenty-five. Twenty-one twenty-five. Okay. I wonder what Watto's working on over there. <laughs> Um, What's Watto doing? Was he in his yeah. toy box? Probably playing in his toy box. Okay. Um, oh. oh, fuck. George, we got a problem. That's it. <sighs> Hang on. What happened? Oh, this sounds serious. What happened? You calculated? Oh, what? worse than that. What? You, you under... Calculated? No. Terry Crews donated? <laughs> Martin Shkreli donated. <laughs> Shkreli's money. George, we got something worse. We what went past what? 37. That's okay. Let's give back that $5.65. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's not getting a sandwich. Now throw it on the ground. <laughs> yeah. That's it. I have a stretch goal. Okay. Wait, for what, Wada? <laughs> for what? Well, you were gone. We did it. We did it. <laughs> the, the stretch goal was you leaving for 30 seconds. <laughs> what, 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 end, I don't know. Should we just end the stream no, now? No, no, no you, got, you went and got something. No, what did USPS finally deliver? <laughs> I got the package from Amazon recently. I was buying some new coffee for is this branded content? <laughs> kind of. <laughs> because it's busy time of year, the holiday season. Hmm. Amazon sending out more mail than ever. And it seems that they've ran out of packing materials. So in my box with the coffee filters was not air bubbles. It was not packing peanuts. It appears that they have now resorted to using as packing materials for their boxes. Props from canceled Amazon TV shows. <laughs> Is that true? I received in a box of coffee filters 
This is garbage that Amazon was throwing away. <laughs> An original Flag 5 Flock Flare from the very much canceled TV series The Tip. Oh my god, Wado. <laughs> Seemingly signed by actor Griffin Newman. Wado, do we want to save this for next month? Is that Papa no. Smurf? Maybe. <laughs> I think this is a good tease for next month. <laughs> yeah. someone, next month? Yes, let someone stew about this for a month. Someone right now watching this who really wants it. Yeah. We'll spend all month just yeah. thinking about it. Yeah. I you think can still feed America next month. America, trust me, America is still going to be hungry a month from now. Well, hypothetically, let's see hypothetically how much someone would pay for this. I also I agree with Andrea Streeter who's saying the Richie Riches aren't awake. $69. Yeah, I mean, I, I think you could get a lot for that. Whereas right now, we're just sort of trying to get whatever spare yeah. Chinese people can throw at us. Yeah, why do I think we save that? Should we try and um, organize just real fast a reunion of Rich's Improv Team America to do a Herald? Yeah, right yeah. Now? let's yeah, talk about definitely. that team. Who's on the team? Oh, you want names? Yeah. Do you remember? No, no, oh, no, no, no. Tell us faces. You should, you, like, <laughs> you should go get rich. Steven, for this, I don't know if you know them all. You should go get rich. You might not know the numbers. You might tap out after Charlie Saunders. Wait, 300. Hold on. Blue Note Viscara says 300. Oh, Watto, maybe. Oh, maybe, maybe. We got maybe, to start maybe. going higher than that. If people want to make this an option, they got to start throwing out some real numbers. It's pretty good. 300's not good. I, I'd like to see bigger. Wow. wow. That's okay. true. A T-shirt went for like two hundred earlier. So yeah, yeah. And we know okay. from that, and we know from that zooming in on that photo that when Watto says he'd like to see bigger, we just judge by the scale of it. He's not, he's not joking around. Avalanche size. Here. <laughs> avalanche. We want an avalanche. Avalanche size. Here. We want an avalanche. Wait a second. Who is What's this? Happening? What's happening? Hello. Oh, no. oh my Hello. God. Are we putting a cherry on top? I'm on the show. I'm <laughs> <laughs> on the show. Okay. You gotta introduce him. Where's Anish? Yeah. Hi. Well, first of all, I brought my lightsaber, but the battery died. So tell me, tell me if you can hear the sound it's making. Yes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And I can't turn it off. Three thirty a.m. He just makes his noise now forever. By pressing the button, I unscrewed the bottom of it, and I'm trying to turn the sound off. Wait, wait. Hey, Zach, this is great because you're actually – this is huge. You're actually guest number 92. Yeah. Well, I we know. need to introduce him. He's not on the show yet. Oh, yeah, Zach, how oh, do you want to be introduced? True. Sorry, that's why I asked if I was on the show. Um, <laughs> oh, a fan. It's always nice to meet a fan. Yeah, just uh, you can just introduce me as a fan. <laughs> okay. Grogu's and Gragas. This next guest is just a fan. It's time to go cherry picking with Zach Sherry. Hey. Hey Zach. Hey, Zach. Well, I really can't turn this off. <laughs> you know, in some ways this that lightsaber is a metaphor for this fundraiser. <laughs> well, I mean I can't, I've been lurking and I came on and my plan was to donate an Irishman um, right here at the end, but I don't know if you guys will be able to fulfill it. At well, point. Zach, Zach, here's something. Tom Sharpling donated an Irishman, but he's he saving did. it for another week. Wow. He's okay. back pocketing the Irishman. So, you well, should have the Irishman fault. If someone that, can figure out how I can turn this off, take the batteries I, out. Take the batteries out. No, I I, I tried. <laughs> um, I will, if I can turn this off in the next ten minutes, I'll donate two hundred dollars. 
<laughs> AKA, I, I, as everyone knows, two hundred dollars. The full Irishman. <laughs> oh, I, oh, okay, here we wait. go. People in the chat are really mad because we didn't give someone a chance to say McClunky. Ooh. Okay, we're making progress. Okay, Zach, let's get this really quick. Let's get this clean. Oh, I, you need a McClunky out of me. No, not from you, Zach. I'm muting you. Ready? Yeah. McClunky. Great. Thank you, Abigail. I, uh, Zach, when you first appeared on the stream before I knew it was you and I just heard my voice echoing, I thought that someone had come on who had already sampled the thing I just said and was playing some sort of weird club remix. Uh, I didn't realize it was just that it's the speakers echoing what was playing on the stream. I, I was I was watching the stream on my TV. Yeah. And that's what you were hearing. Mm-hmm. Mm. Because mm -hmm. when you were trying to get to a thousand people, I fired it up on seven devices in my home. Oh, wow. Oh, you're no, fine. Zach. Zach, you were trying to stop the sound that the lightsaber makes. <laughs> but what if we go in the opposite direction? Ah. What if instead of trying to stop the sound, we own the sound? We own it? George, do you want to uh, you want to start up another club club hit to this? Lightsaber, 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 light. Saber light, 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 Light saber, 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 light Say burlight. 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 I mean, I guess, I guess doing a long stream isn't that hard if this is what it is. I guess doing a long stream isn't really hard if this is what you do. I mean, I guess doing a long stream isn't really hard if this is what you do. If this is what you do. If this is what you do. Can we get a clean McClunky from you? You can't. Well, you can't get it fully clean, but you can get it with a little bit of saber in the background. That's okay. Yeah. 
Do you guys remember when when bitches be horny for Spo tried to leave like a half an hour ago? Yeah. <laughs> then I heard that more was happening. I was trying to give an out for the for the for the real crew, but then it was like, let's do a stretch goal, and I was like, I'll help. Yeah. And I got another guest on. Well. This stream, this is now hour 18 of the stream, which means this stream is old enough to be drafted into the United States military <laughs> if, if hours were years. And they do feel like it now. Hours feel like years. That's really powerful. Think about it. Oh, what does that mean? Think about it. Hours were years. <sighs> Hours were years. 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 If hours were years. Hours were years. If hours were yours. Hours were yours. Hours were yours. Ours were yours. We were defeating America. Ours were yours. We'd be selling America. Ours were yours. Defeating America. It was um, Eli Newell, Eddie Dunn. <laughs> um, Vanessa Renard, Nick Gibbons, Charlie Sanders, Will McLaughlin, Rich Summer, and uh, Allison Becker. Yeah, and may the force be with you always.